Oh yeah, that's fun. Welcome everyone. Let me know if you can hear me. I just want to make sure that we're going good, that everyone can hear, that uh, everything looks good. Please, please, please share this with your friends. Uh, share it with 
whoever you want. Let me just let me know if you can in the comment section if you can hear me. Um, hi, Elizabeth. Hello, hello. Let me know. Can everyone hear me? I would love, love, love to make sure that everyone can hear me and that we're going really good and that, um, uh, you know, I just want to make sure everyone can hear me so we can get started. Okay, so uh, hopefully we're having or hopefully everyone had a beautiful, amazing Thanksgiving yesterday to our friends in the States, to those of you that do not celebrate Thanksgiving. I hope that yesterday was just a beautiful day for you in general. Um, typically in the United States, what happens is... Uh, Thanksgiving is kind of that pivot time that we turn over to the holidays and we just kind of get full fledged in the holiday spirit. And then today, of course, is Black Friday. If you can turn it down just a little bit so I don't hear the echo, both of you guys. Um, then what happens is today becomes a day that's all about kind of shopping. And I think it's more so it used to be so annoying for me, uh, but now I think it's more so a much needed time this year more than ever to just get in the holiday spirit, to uh, get excited, to try new things, to engage with different things and support small businesses. So today I have a very awesome lineup for you guys. For, I know it might be a long day. Many of you have things to do, which I totally understand. But for those of you that want to hang out with me, I have, of course, Fava TV classes for you guys. We'll go over that stuff in a minute. I am going to be showing you in a few moments um, all about airbrushing, right? And airbrushing on clothing. Because one trend that I'm seeing happen this year is more handmade, made with love, personalized gifts. So I'm going to show you guys how I uh, personalize shoes, hats, some shortcuts for those of you that have been thinking about an airbrush system, which I have right by me. Um, and I want to show you guys how to make money using that system. And that's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, I have all these specials to go over with you guys because there's a lot of um, sales going on at Silly Farm today uh, or throughout the whole entire weekend that I want you guys to become aware about. And please talk to me, chat with me, let me know uh, what you want to know. And then I have a special guest, Susie Amaro, who I love so much. Um, she has a design for you guys using her brand new shimmer stroke collection which is like out of this world beautiful and we are going to do a real live kind of design marketing session for you guys and the reason that i felt this is super necessary is because many of us um, have experienced you know obviously a slowdown in our business and we've gone through all those ups and downs of like being sad of being angry of being um all of the the gamut right um and one thing that we kind of put to the side is our marketing because marketing as I've talked to you guys about in the past is the connection of people so hopefully I can show you guys some cool ways to create really good marketing materials that are going to benefit your business and then you can take advantage of those and you can find out about how we're adding graphic content that you can download use and um, used to help you with your own business on Fava TV because that's part of the Fava TV special. So, uh, so much going on today. So, so much. So please guys, uh, chat with me. Hello, Ceci. Hello. Yes, I didn't didn't uh, do my hair today, but where do you guys get a close up of my Lee press on nails? I am so excited about these. Hey now, because I called Lisa this morning. I was like, I didn't do my nails. She said, I got you covered. So, I'm going to attempt to airbrush with nails on. It's going to be amazing. We're going to do all that. Okay. So welcome, everybody. Please, please, please. Like I said, if you have questions, all I need you to do is just chat them. This is going to be an interactive day for me, for you, to help you to get the most out of it. I think you're going to enjoy both the marketing and the airbrush and the painting. It's all going to be fun the whole day. Okay, so let's just get the the um, sales part out of the way. And not out of the way, but let me show you what we have going on at Silly Farm today because this is, um, like I said, Black Friday. And we are a small business and we truly appreciate when you support small business. Um, all of our cakes, our arty cakes, our rainbow cakes, we hand make these still. These are like little Silly Farm paint elves um, making them. We pre or we hand make and mix 
the handy sandy we make this um i have the msds sheet let me tell you something a lot of energy blood sweat tears went into making handy sandy for you guys to make sure that there was a healthy product for you so there's lots of specials that i want to show you guys and give you ideas of something that you could treat yourself your friend your family to uh this holiday season so the first one i believe is the um the face fun kits. Okay, so uh, basically the face fun kits come in two different styles, meaning like one comes with a rainbow cake and one comes with just paints. These are a fabulous gift for anybody that you wanna get started painting or your kids or you wanna try. Like maybe you have a sister-in-law, a brother-in-law, a friend who's like, I love face painting, I don't know, I don't wanna make a huge investment. Right now, this weekend only, it's buy one, get one free. So you can give it as a gift. You can um, you can actually, if you want to, we're going to talk about it in a little while, how to make money right now. Um, get stock up on these right now and use them for your virtual parties, right? So there's a lot of things you can do with them. And I want to show you guys what makes the Face Fun Kit so special. Um, so if you'll go to that camera, yes. Okay. So let me show you guys. So this is what the face fun kits look like, okay? So this one comes with a rainbow cake, but not just a rainbow cake. It comes with a lot of fun stuff. Let me move this up a little bit more so you can see it. Okay, so it comes with a booklet that's like a step-by-step, -step, explains, has designs inside step-by-step -step designs for someone who's like really needs to know um so this is super helpful a uh, little booklet it includes information about our youtube channel so that they can watch all the free videos right and then this particular one is the rainbow party kit and it comes with a rainbow cake and six colors sponge glitter and brush and 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 stencils okay so for those people who are just getting started or you're looking for an activity for your kids or you, like i said you want to host a virtual paint party you can get the face fun kits right now on sale for buy one get one free that's a, this kit is 34 dollars. the rainbow party kit so that's like saving 34 dollars. that makes them 17 dollars each so what a great offer this is if you know somebody who's artistic um as of lately if you've noticed or you've seen me on Facebook, uh, my son, my son started a business called the Clay Kings, and I'm really pushing them to use their creativity. And one thing I've noticed is that the more I let them create, the more they're doing it and the more they're loving it. So if you have kids who show creativity, this is a great kit for them. Rainbow cake, colors, glitter. The only difference between the classic kit and the rainbow party kit is simply just one has a rainbow cake in it. So it and stencils. So it depends. But check out the site. If you go to sillyfarm.com, you will see all of the variety of face fun kits. We have ones that are mermaid themed, princess themed, Christmas themed. So if you're going to be painting for your church or you're going to be or uh, you want to donate something to your church or to your school or to the PTA moms, uh, these are great kits to do it because then you don't have to give them your supplies you don't have to go volunteer um i know as soon as schools find out what i do for a living they're like "Ooh, what's mrs green doing so it is helpful guys to to have something that you can donate in good faith um definitely makes a huge deal and people really like it and like i said this is a great fabulous kit okay so we have bogo on the face fun kits all right the next special is let's see what do we have there oh my favorite my favorite my favorite 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 yeah you could put up that one let me just get my little board up yep that one perfect okay and me the, the second camera yep okay so let's see let's see let's see everybody loves arty cakes right so 
The arty cakes, the arty cakes are buy two, get one free. Now today you're gonna notice that we are re releasing, launching the beautiful Susie Amaro collection. You'll see them in a minute. She has a awesome tutorial for us, but all of our arty cakes are on sale today, this weekend. So it's buy two, get one free. That means if you love Patty De Leon, if you love Jillian, um, Jillian, Oh my God, I can't think of it from Emerald Arts. I'm sorry. <laughs> Jillian Chow from Emily <laughs> Emerald Arts. I'm sorry, guys. Not enough coffee. Um, if you love Malena, if you love, I mean, we have so many, Flor Moreno, uh, we have so many beautiful cakes designed by different artists, okay? So Cameron, Cameron's Cakes, I love Cameron. Uh, so there's, and I designed a whole collection of arty cakes. Uh, so there are so many beautiful cakes to choose from. And I'm gonna show you guys, for those of you, chances are if you're watching, I have a feeling you know what an arty cake is, but sometimes you don't know how beautiful they are until you see them in action, right? Like until you say, oh, I didn't know that that cake could do that. So, um, so yeah. Oh, where did it go? I wonder why it turned itself around. That's okay. I'll figure that out in just a moment. Uh, okay. So um, if you see this one, a lot of people see combinations online and it's hard, right? Like it's hard to see how beautiful something is until you see it in person. And like this one right here, uh, is called Texas Sunset, designed by our beautiful amiguita, Patty de Leon. And she sent me this combination. And maybe when you have Lee, okay, got it. I was going to say, when you have your Lee Press on nails, they don't always. <laughs> so I got some of these bling. Who doesn't love bling? Uh, there's lots of bling sales going on today, guys. And I'm going to talk to you guys about that in a minute, too. Um, but if you have bling, like, I don't know where this one came from. Uh, and actually, I need some scissors. Yeah. Sorry, guys. So I'm just going to cut a little piece of this bling just like this. Because this one already has adhesive on it, which I won't lie to you. I love that because it makes my life a lot easier. I mean, it doesn't stick as long, but hey, it still works really good. Okay, so I'm just taking this little piece of bling right here, and I can put it right in the middle from here, and then it, you know, oh, wait, where'd you go? Okay, still there. Thank you. Okay, just making sure. Okay, and then look at this beautiful cake, okay? This cake is magical. I love this cake. Um, I use it for a lot, which for me is just looks so good on every skin tone. And for me, that's very important because when you're uh, painting kids, you want everyone to look beautiful. So one thing I can say about this cake is that if you have a beautiful cake, it does all the work for you, right? You don't have to do too much work if the cake already is beautiful and bright and vibrant, right? So I am using a arty angle brush. So this is like a larger version. Um, I love this brush as well. Really good to cover larger areas. And I'm just going to bring it in to the corners of the eyes. Oh, look, guys, I switched that around. That's okay. You know what? I have a little baby wipe right here. So delete. Okay. Isn't it good to be live? Because then you realize everybody can make mistakes, right? Me, you, we all can do it. Okay. All right. So I'm going to make sure that the yellow is on top. Bring it to the corners of the eyes. And you see how beautiful those colors are? You see how they just pop? Um, and like I said, on every single skin tone is what makes this color combination so beautiful. And I'm not from Texas and I don't live there, but I can imagine uh, that this Texas sunset is just this beautiful uh, because if Patty designed it, then I have a great feeling that it is, that this is what it looks like. But the other day, it kind of did look like this in the sky. It looked like a candy, um, a candy sky. Me and Lisa were outside like, oh my gosh. So you see how fast and easy that can be, guys? And for those of you that love, love, love painting roses and you're out of it or you're home and you need something to do, 
get yourself a rose cake. This one is bright rose or light rose, I apologize. So it has white and um, light uh, neon pink and red in it so that you can practice all your roses. And I will tell you, I've taken rose classes from everybody, okay, guys? Literally everybody. And one thing that I can say about the rose classes is um, – as of lately, Flor Moreno just taught, not Flor, I apologize, Catarine Romero from Mexico. Um, it, she just premiered a class on Faba TV. <sighs> Incredible um, on roses, and I love watching her. But for those of you that are practicing and want to practice your roses, this is a beautiful cake to do it. That way, you can practice your petals, you can practice directions, you can see if you like the blends, and like I said, you're getting buy two, get one free, right? So you're saving money, you're investing in your success, you're investing in your kits, you're growing your art, and usually when you pay for something and you had to pay out of your own pocket, it means more to you. So uh, it really helps to have products that you really like, that you're going to get your use out of, that you can put to work. And like I said, you can never go wrong um, with an RDK because chances are you're going to use it. Also, in case you didn't know, guys, this is important, uh, you can use your face paint on paper, on cards, you can make gift bags with it. You can paint, like if you haven't seen, Elizabeth Gale did a few amazing classes on Faba TV on painting cards and she uses her cakes. She uses them. And number one, it makes creating the cards so much faster and better, which I believe I have a card down here. Let me show you. Okay, so here's a greeting card that I made out of uh, clay for another class I was doing. But if you just turn it inside out, you can use the cards and paint directly on them, especially if you get this watercolor paper. You will save so much time and so much money. And you can send people personalized, hand-painted cards. And I will tell you, Getting mail that's not bills is such a lost art, right? Like how many of you are still sending mail? Not a lot of people are. So when I have the opportunity to paint something and send somebody something that's made with love, um, that you painted, it's a big, big deal. Yeah, let me see that one. Great job. So you see, you can paint directly on your cards. I'll show you guys. I have this video um, in my uh, video corner, I painted this gift bag, okay? So you see, you can make this, give somebody a nice gift, write their name on it. And that's a nice way to present a gift. These are dollar store bags, guys. So just think outside of the box and treat yourself to some new arty cakes that you can just make your life more colorful, right? It's Black Friday, but we don't have to just... Uh, you know, think that way. We can think in full color. We can add as much color as we want. And you see, once you start painting on paper, I won't lie to you, it becomes very addictive, okay? Um, actually, if this doesn't inspire you, I don't know what will, but I started painting on those bags and I presented that class to the libraries. And they were like, oh, okay, that sounds like a fun class. So, you know, when you think about it, if you enjoy it, um, you can make it possible. So you see how beautiful you, these color combinations are, guys? They're, the possibilities are endless um, with paint. And like I said, don't waste your art. You guys are artists, and these are skills that not everybody has. Um, a lot of people are not artistically inclined. And guess what happens with them? They struggle because their skill set stops at a certain point. And ours, you can create and you can keep on going and you can teach yourself new things. So, you know, definitely look and browse through our RDK collection. Like I said, there's a brand new collection from Susie Amaro uh, that's called the Easy Sparkles. And this one is also a patty cake. Uh, I love that name, patty cake, patty cake, patty cake. Um, so you see how beautiful these colors are. And if you are going to be painting greeting cards, right, 
then use your cakes, right? Some of you are concerned like, oh, they're going to expire. They're not going to do so great. I'm going to have to throw everything away. That's not true. There's lots of ways that you can use them. And we're going to go over how to make money with them very shortly. But look at how beautiful, guys, what you can create with these. You can create directly on paper as well as skin. So don't forget, the Artie Cakes are on sale. Buy two, get one free. They're handmade with love uh, from the Silly Farm Elves. Uh, as are our rainbow cakes, we put a lot of time, energy, love into making them. Um, they're not made by a machine. It's us. It's us creating, inventing, and painting them. All right. So then our next special, I have to move along. I promised myself I wasn't going to talk too much today. Okay. Our next special is, uh, let's see. Hold on. Um, okay. The Susie Cakes, right? Okay. So you just got to put the camera too. That one, that one, yeah. Okay, now, okay. So uh, last year we released a new collection of Suzy Cakes and we're doing it again today. A brand, brand, brand new collection. They are called the Easy Shimmers. They are incredible. They are fabulous. Uh, designed by the one and only Suzy who will be joining us later on the program. And these beautiful cakes are, if you have used her Easy Stroke collection, you know why they're a favorite, right? I used to think that every RDK you can ever think of was already created. And the truth is, it's not. She called me and she said, I have an idea for new cakes. And, you know, these shimmer colors in the Fab Line are so beautiful. So uh, can I make some new ones? And she made us new cakes. And then she named them after crystals. Oh, my goodness. It's so beautiful. So turn on the background camera so I can show you guys. Um, this one, I believe, is called Amethyst. Okay, like look at this, it's shimmers. And of course there's the line of black in there. And the reason that we wanted the line of black is because then it does the work for you guys. Let me show you what I mean. And that is so crucial because a lot of the times what happens is we do this beautiful work with our arty cakes and then we don't know how to outline it or we don't know what to do uh, next. But when you have that little bit of black, what it does is it just makes everything pop. So, you know, this combination of the shimmer purple and the dark purple and then the black, then you can create literally the possibilities are endless in terms of how you want to um, use these cakes, okay? So you can use them with the shimmer side and then it's just gonna give you this beautiful pearlescent, you know, uh, color selection. You can use it, like I said, with more of the black if you wanted to, to make it a little bit more of like, say, an eyeliner where you would use the black closest to the eyes. And you see that color selection that you're going to get. You get an immediate um, uh, eyeliner. It's just such a beautiful, beautiful combination. I love anything that Susie makes. Um, just helps me so much when I paint because I like to paint and then use any extra time that I have, like adhering bling or putting more glitter. So when my cakes do the work for me, it helps speed everything up. So there's the green shimmers. Look at how gorgeous that is. Ooh la la. Imagine using that for your leaves. And then this one is the amethyst, like I said. Any questions? Uh, this, this, this question, I don't know if I should say yes or um, no. No, no. Say cancel? Yeah, just say cancel. Okay. And then this one is the orange shimmer and Ziva. Oh, I love this combination. Anything with Ziva in it is beautiful for me. Okay, guys, like that's my favorite color. It's so incredibly gorgeous. Um, sapphire, that one is called sapphire. Gold, right? So gold rush. Look at this. Incredible. Absolutely marvelous. And pink tourmaline. So for all my crystal fans out there, ooh, this is going to balance your chakras, your paint chakras, right? I'm going to put this one right here. And just, or, 
So you can body paint your chakras. Do whatever makes you happy, guys, okay? I definitely think that you are going to love these Susie cakes. So she is going to be doing a demonstration for us very shortly. So if you want to see more of these amazing cakes in action, stay tuned. Like I said, we have a busy, long day. And I know Facebook is awesome because you scroll in and out and you jump in and you jump out. Um, but I encourage you guys to participate because this program is for you um, to learn about the specials and sales, also to learn because we are going to be airbrushing and painting very shortly. Okay, so our next special is, let's see what's up. Oh, okay, bling. You can never have enough bling. You just got it, yeah. Um, you can never have enough bling, guys. We have a fabulous sale where you get five bling packs for just $5. You can use this bling to bling out your cell phone, to bling out your water bottle, like with your spray bottle. Um, my spray bottle, tell me I have it in here. Don't know where it went. Um, but I just took these blings and I put them on my spray bottle so that one, I don't lose it, so I don't lose the grip. Um, you can jazz up anything you want. But you get five sheets, and I think there's like 250 blings per sheet. And you get them for five dollars, five pack for five dollars. That's like a fantastic deal. So definitely check out that amazing deal um, on Silly Farm because, like I said, we have so many specials going on today. It's gonna blow your mind. Okay, our next special is oh, this is this is my favorite. Why? Because I created it. Um, but okay. So, do you know somebody who's a germaphobe? I do. It's my mom, my aunts, not Marcella, definitely not Marcella. Uh, I have a large family, my brother-in-law, big time really avoiding germs. And I appreciate them because they are helping stop the spread of the coronavirus by wearing a mask, by washing their hands, all of the above. So um, the Handy Sani and All Natural Clean Kit is on sale. It comes in this beautiful box um, that has my picture on the back. Like, who doesn't want that? Just kidding. <laughs> uh, I'll show a close up. All right. Yep. You can put this one. Okay, so you get this beautiful box, guys, right? I designed this fabulous box. That sounds so conceited. I apologize. But I really love designing, okay? Uh, so I designed this box, and here's me and my crew on the back. Tells you a little bit about our story of why I created this because it was important, and it's important the day I created it, and it's important now. Um, and inside of this box, this gift set that you can send to someone that you love is... Hold on. So what happens when you wear nails. I'm not used to it. <laughs> I'm not used to wearing nails, guys. Okay. So inside of this kit, you are going to get brush bath. Okay, so spray and gel. Now, for those of you that don't know, you can use brush bath on your face every day. I had to switch over from using harsher uh, cleaners on my face just because they were disrupting my pores and making um, and irritating the inside of my eyes. But when I was cleaning off my mascara, brush bath is all natural and it will clean your mascara. It will clean your face. You can clean your brushes and your sponges. And it is uh, my favorite, favorite, favorite. You will also get the handy Sani all purpose spray with the spray. So you can clean your counters, your kits, your car, your shoes, spray your shoes. They walk on the floor and then you walk in your house. And even if you leave them by the door, you take things with you from the floor. So spray your shoes. I do. My kids feet smell like cheese. I don't know why. Um, I tell them to wear socks, but their shoes still stink. And Crocs, my God, Crocs smell so bad, okay? So spray with Handy Sani. Spray your shower after you take a shower. Just get into a habit of spraying things, right? Like I like to keep our doorknobs clean. I like to spray our counters. This is all natural. I have lots of videos on my YouTube channel about the effectiveness. So guys, do yourself a huge favor and get you this beautiful kit. In addition to that, you are going to get our signature uh, handy sani spray, a hand sanitizer that you can connect. This is a keychain that you can connect to your purse, you can connect to your kit, you can connect to your chair, and it smells good. It feels so good on your hands. Uh, people will be happy to, to watch you 
cleaning your hands, right? What an important thing to remember. Also, uh, when I created it, I did it and I created this heart on it for a reason. Uh, one, I want us to take away the fear of cleaning our hands and thinking about needing to be clean in a fearful way. You can spread love and not germs with Andy Sandy, okay? And then last but not least, inside you also get our fabulous paint pal sponge bag so you can put your underwear if you have those nice thongs i don't fit in those so no my thongs don't go in there um but you can put things in here that you don't want to lose like your socks if you have baby socks if you have bows if you have your sponges and you just want to clean them like i said you can use the silly farm sponge bag throw it right inside of your washing machine it's smell resistant um so it's a really nice or or just put all of your stuff inside of it and carry it with you to your gigs and then hang it from your chair so that people know that you're clean, that you care, that you have like a cleaning supplies on hand. Because one thing that I can say is that cleaning supplies are getting more expensive. I was at Publix yesterday and toilet paper, which was very scarce, was $17, $17 for a 12 pack. So we want to mind our uh, materials, save money, uh, put good chemicals into the earth if there's such a good uh, thing. Um, but take care of your body, your throat, your health, all the things. So you'll get this set. It's on sale. It comes in this beautiful box, so you don't even have to gift wrap it. Um, and if you want me to, I'll even sign the box and say, you know, with love, Heather. It's up to you. Just put it in the comment section, okay? So that is the Handy Sani and uh, the gift set. Again, it comes in this beautiful, beautiful box, which I think happens to be fabulous. So hopefully, everybody's waiting to hear the price. Oh, the okay. price. How much was the price? Where is it? It was, oh, it's, it's up. Price. Yeah, it's on. Okay. Waiting for you to repeat. Okay, so the price is $35. That is a great, great, great price guys okay i will tell you get all of that a beautiful presentation and it's made with love which for me is very important okay our next special next special how am i doing on my home shopping network am i going too fast because you know what guys i like to talk it's unfortunate you know back in the day in school the teachers would say i talk too much the good news is it's all coming in handy right now okay so see, sometimes teachers are not right. They're only right when you're not listening. Okay, so the next special is the five for five, another five pack, right? So you can have those five blings, right? You can stuff them in stockings. You can send them as presents to your friends. Like when you give gifts, you don't have to give expensive gifts. Some of the best gifts I've ever received are gifts that either people have made me or just thoughtful, useful gifts. Um, and I please forgive me since I don't remember who sent it to me. But several years ago, somebody, when I released my Paint Pal collection of brushes, somebody crocheted me a um, tree ornament of a pink brush. And I Every single year when I put up my tree, I put up that brush and I always smile and it makes me happy. And I don't know if they made it. I don't know if they had somebody who made it, but it was such a beautiful, thoughtful gift. And I love it still to this day. So just keep that in mind. Okay. So the Paint Pal sponge bag, five. So $5. And you get five free sponges inside. And these are not just any sponges. These are our heart sponges, the ones to show you that we love you so much. And the cool thing about them is if you cut them in half, then you have a very good sponge style, right? So a petal sponge, so which gives you this good soft side to make good butterflies. In addition to that, you can use it inside of your arty cakes with this piece, which let me show you. Let me show you what I mean. Let me show you guys what I mean. Okay, if there's any questions, slow me down. Let me know. I want you guys to uh, feel happy today talking to me. And I promise we are going to uh, have a lot of fun today. Okay, so, yeah, uh, it's up. It, it just remember, we're on a delay. Okay, so you can use this round side to go inside of your arty cakes just like that, so that you can, oop, I'm dropping things left and right, guys, don't worry, I'll get there, so that you can a sponge, right, so you have a choice in the way that you apply it, either um, with a sponge, you can use the long side to be able to load it up as well, 
for your butterflies. And mind you guys, I'm painting upside down, so please forgive me. I don't know why my camera flipped, but I can do that in a second. I'll fix it. So you can use these for butterflies. So you see, you can use this side, you can use this side, either one, you can use this side if you want. Uh, where is the rainbow cake? Is there a rainbow cake directly next to you, Marcella? In that box. Yes, it's in that box. Thank you, Lisa. Any of them. So you can use, like I said, several different ways uh, to use it. Like I said, you can use the flattest side. And these are free 99 inside of your bag. So it's a $5 bag and you get five free sponges. And these are a little bit thinner sponges than our blue sponges. So, you know, if you wanted to just do one use only, you could. And look, guys, makes the perfect butterfly shape. And all I did was cut it in half. So technically, technically, since you're getting five sponges and you're gonna cut them in half, that makes 10 sponges. What a good deal, guys. So buy one for you, buy one for your friend. So remember, these sponge bags are on sale. So it is $5 and you get five free sponges, which turn into 10. So it's like, you know, when Jesus performed his first miracle, he turned water into wine. It's almost the same exact thing, just a little different. Just saying. Okay. How'd you guys feel about that little one? Just kidding. Okay. So, can, they not cut it in half and use the whole sponge for the can you not cut it in half and use the whole sponge? The problem for the is for the wings. Um, maybe. I don't know. But the problem is it's not big enough to do that. So I don't know. Maybe you could. I don't know. Get creative and show me. Let's do a show and tell. Okay? Okie dokie. Our next special. Ooh, some of you have been waiting for this. Some of you have been super duper waiting for this. You have been waiting for me to clear off this mess. Raise your hand if you're a little messy. Raise your hand. I can see you online to do it. It's so unfortunate, right, that as face painters, sometimes we're a little discombobulated. And Marcella had the nerve last week to tell me I was unorganized. I was like, who did I get it from? From her. No, no, really. Who did I get it from? From you. Um, okay. So some of you have been waiting on this and you've been waiting on this palette in your life. Look at this. Look at this beauty, right? Ah, what is so fabulous about this beautiful kit? I'm going to show you. Okay. So in this fabulous kit, you get four full-size rainbow cakes, okay? Four. And you get, how many is this? Ten. Ten fabulous colors. And these are not baby colors. These are 16 grams. I go through one of these like every six months when I'm painting a lot. This is a lot of paint. And this is a lot of paint. And these rainbow cakes are handmade, like I said, in the Silly Farm um, studio here. I mean, this one, hello, it's by Flor Moreno called Sweet Rainbow. It will definitely make you have a fabulous day, I promise. Uh, this one is one of the most popular ones called Summer Swirl. If you open this in your kit, true story, kids will say, I want that. They see the pink and it's done, okay? You put a little glitter on it. This one is from the Vanessa Mendoza collection. And it is uh, called Ocean Breeze. And at first, I didn't know I was going to love it so much until I started using it for everything from like butterflies to dragon masks. This is such, this blend right here will blow you away. I promise. You'll be like, oh. And then this one is called Roar. And if you remember Jenny Saunders, go to fabatv.com and go watch her classes you will realize why she's so amazing and why her color combinations just blew you away and why her painting was so fabulous because she has the best combinations. And this one is called Roar and it is also in this kit. So this kit includes all of this for $50 off. Guys, this kit is $99, 99, tell me. Can any other colors be switched? No, so these are preset palettes. If you wanna, you can't even order this palette otherwise, like it's not on the site. Um, so this palette is pre-made. There's two versions, there are two versions. There is palette A and palette B, and there's only a few of them. 
So at this price, I can guarantee you they are not going to last very long. So you have this choice, and then you also have this choice, okay? So this one has uh, Spring Fling, and I believe Goddess, and then Punk Rock, super popular one. This one's Punk Rock. Um, and this one has tango in it. So this is a beautiful one as well. Has gold and purples and liner colors. You can do butterflies, superheroes. You can do anything. Plus, it comes in this really fabulous case, okay, so that you can keep everything all organized. And the price is incredible. It's under $100, guys. Each of those rainbow cakes are almost $20. So you can do this, Matt. This case is $30. This is 20 40 60 80 in just rainbow cakes. Plus, you put another $30 for the palette. That's already over $100. These are each $7 times 10, that's $70. You are saving an incredible amount of money. This is a fabulous palette. For those of you that don't know, face paint has a very, very long shelf life if you take care of it, okay? Please don't put bleach all over it. You can literally just clean your stuff um, with brush, bath, and water by keeping it in a cool, dry place. But this amazing palette, like I said, is only $99. Question. Say, which one is one? Which one is which? Okay, this is the B that has um, that has the sweet rainbow in it, and A has uh, spring fling and punk rock in it. Okay, so A and B, and again, these palettes will not last, and I don't get to have these specials all the time. You know, I put things aside every month for Black Friday because I want to be able to offer everybody the best deals. So these are the best deals, okay? I use this kit, and, uh, and it's a great kit. I love it so much. All right, okay, moving right along so much, so much good stuff. Also, important to remember, important to know, um, I know, guys, most of us are still so sad about not being able to find, I'll go over that one in one second. Uh, most of us are really upset about not being able to, um, to, to find the gold grip brushes anymore. But you don't have to be upset. I worked with Low Cornell to make these. These are the Lux brushes. They make them for us. They were modeled after. This is the ferrule. This is the hair that makes the gold grip brushes. They make these for us. Not the pink ones. They make these. So if you love the snap, if you love the lines, if you're addicted to the gold grip brushes, they are made directly for us um, by Low Cornell. Oh, okay. Yep. Oh, there we go. Okay. So we're just, I'm going to show you. So when you're looking for a brush, typically what you're looking for is that it has a nice bounce. And what does a bounce mean? It means when you're pressing on it, that when the bristles flick up, that they don't all separate like a bad hair day, like when your hair is frizzy. That's not what you want. You also want to make sure that when it dries, it doesn't fray. And also when you are loading it, that the bristles stick together nicely. That's what you want. Um, and that's what these brushes do. Um, so the this is the number four, probably the most popular out of all of the swirl brushes. But you can make the most beautiful teardrops. You can make swirls, you can make curls. For those of you that um, love to practice teardrops, these brushes are going to change your life. So if you are sad about the gold grip brushes uh, not being available anymore, you have nothing to be sad about. We make them in three, four, and five, and that is called the Silly Farm Lux Swirl brushes and they're gold. I was so grateful after seven years of trying, I got them to make it for me. And I think they were just so sick of hearing me call every year and saying, please, face painters love these. And they were like, who are face painters? Like they didn't even know who we were. They didn't even know that that was a real business. I was like, let me school you in the wide world of face painters. We're the ones buying up all 
of the gold grip brushes. Because, you know, artists use whatever they have, but we're very partial to brushes. So I guarantee you that the more that you play with them, the more you're going to fall in love. And like I said, when they dry, they dry to the most beautiful uh, original finish. You can get really nice on the on the tips of them. You can make thicker swirls like I'm doing here. You can make thinner swirls. They hold the paint really nicely. And that is a very important um, thing to think about when you're face painting because if your brushes do not take the paint really well, you know what happens? You don't get to paint really well. So see how I can make thin lines, thick lines. And that's just with a four, guys. See? See what I mean? So those are on sale. The three pack is normally $24. It is on sale for only $18 for three. It's a great deal. Okay, guys. So you're going to be able to get in. It comes in this really cute little case and then you can pop it, right? It's like fun to play with. You get three beautiful paintbrushes inside of this set. So it is on sale. Instead of 24, it is on sale for 18. So you can put this together with a sponge bag. And look, you have a beautiful gift. Okay, what a beautiful gift to give somebody. I think it's a nice thoughtful gift. I think that it's a nice way to spoil your friends. And yeah, okay. So yes, let's just keep on going. If there's any questions, guys, please feel free to ask me. I love hearing from you. All right. Now, this is the most important one. Not the most important one, but there's a lot of people who call me. And every year I say the same exact thing. If you're considering learning to airbrush or you want to buy a system, before you buy anything, please let me help you. Let me talk to you. Let me explain to you. Many people see airbrushing and the first thing that they think is what oh i want to do that because it's cool and the upsides are that yes you can have a lot of different ways to make money which we're going to talk about when i start showing you guys um there's lots of ways to make money f using your airbrush you can do shoes you can do hats you can do airbrush tanning you can do cakes you can do a multitude of things but there is also a larger investment as you can see by the price right um, but in addition to that, there's maintenance. So I always tell people, please, before you buy a system that's $2,000, do yourself a favor, invest in taking a class. I promise you it'll either save you or it'll it'll make you really excited about investing in it. Do you have any questions, Marcella? Oh, I thought you were raising your hand. Okay. So this is our complete system. And there's two things that make it even more complete. This system is include includes a free flag, okay, to advertise your services. It's a 14 foot flag. I promise you, if you go to Signorama, if you go somewhere, you will pay at least $200 for that flag. So you're going to get the free flag. In addition to the flag, I am including an ultrasonic cleaner for free. Now, why did I decide to do that? I decided to do that because in, if when you buy a system of this size, that means you're going to have six guns. You're going to have a lot of stencils, everything on that banner you're going to have. I wanted you to be able to clean your stuff easy and without stress. So I am including a free ultrasonic cleaner with this bundle. You're going to get six guns, 100 stencils, a 14-foot flag, Four, six colors of four ounce makeup. You're going to get a, a manifold, all of your hoses, cleaner. You're going to be able to open up your kit and offer your services right away. Now, I will tell you, I have not been wanting to face paint. It's just something about, you know, there's COVID going on and about being really close to someone's face right now. Um, just is not where I'm at, but airbrushing allows me a lot more flexibility because I've been able to do shirts and hats and there's no touch involved when you're doing these, um, these kind of personalized favors. So it's given me an amazing option to be able to decorate and create and, um, and make different things without having to go out there and face paint. So if you are considering airbrushing, I promise you this is an amazing deal. You will make this back. Um, on this kit right away. I invested in my own system 11 years ago, maybe even more, and it paid for itself in two months. And I believe that if you practice and you get good, you're going to love airbrushing. 
It's just going to get you over the hump of saying, oh, my God, can I afford a $2,000 investment? If you are committed to learning, to being proactive with it, I promise you it is going to make you a ton of money. And you're going to thank me later because we are going to be doing, I'm going to show you how to make some shoes in just a few minutes, okay? Everybody good so far? Any questions? I know it's like a lot to talk about, but I only have one more kind of special to go over and then we're going to um, we're gonna have a little class, okay? Okay, last but not least, whoop, whoop. okay, the palette sale. So we teamed up with um, a bunch of Fabit TV instructors with Margie. I love Margie. Hi, Margie. Um, with Ilse, who is fabulous as well. We're going to watch Ilse in action next. We're going to take a little break and let her paint for you and show you why her color palettes are so incredible. These palettes are on sale for $15. That is almost $10 off, guys. It also includes a free brush. So if you add that in, it's kind of like getting it for $10, okay? Um, so let me show you these. So that's the Ilse palette incredible she designed those like the colors that go in it we're going to take a class from ilsi in just two minutes for those of you that want to paint along um but what makes this palette so special is each person picked the colors that they like right so like in here there's the pet shimmer petrol blue gold because she loves oh, where do you see the way she rocks that gold uh this is uh copper and she uses this on the lips and the eyes. And then this one is the berry wine. And it's just so beautiful. She uses this color for lips all the time. And she mixes it with the copper. And it's like, woof, so beautiful. Um, also, Ocean Shimmer. I'm, oops, sorry, guys. This is one of the most beautiful colors. And I'm going to show you guys. Because a lot of people don't realize how gorgeous it is until they actually see it in action. You know, sometimes you see things online and you're like, oh, that's pretty, but does it work? Look at this. So immediately when you get it wet, you can see the metallics being activated. And that is something that you should look for with metallics because they can be deceiving, I'm not going to lie to you. So if you see how beautiful this is on the skin, it literally will just take your breath away in terms of the colors, uh, coverage, and the sparkle, and the shimmer on it. So for all my mermaids, you cannot lie and say, hi, perfect timing. Um, you, will, you can't deny how beautiful this color is, right? It blends. You can put it on with a brush or a sponge, which is important because a lot of the time, some colors only look good if you put them on with a sponge or if you put them on with a brush, but you can blend these. That's what's inside of the strawberry shortcake cake. And you see what you get, beautiful opaque coverage. So you have ocean shimmer. You also have this color, which again is the uh, snow patrol or snow petrol uh, blue. And look at this one. Again, this one has a shimmer. So it comes in shimmer and non-shimmer. Uh, but I like anything with shimmer. Why? Because it just looks better. But you see how beautiful that color is? Like it just pops. And the cool part about Fab and the reason that I work so hard on it is because I wanted people to be able to blend with it. I wanted the colors to be blendable and beautiful and stay, still stay nice and bright throughout the day and that you can go back in and rework it. And that's what Fab is. And for those of you that don't know, because sometimes I impress myself, sometimes not, but sometimes I do. I'm going to show you why it's also. So this was one of my main things when I was creating it with them. Is I said I needed to come off uh, because, you know, I'm a mom. And what happens with bath time is, you know, nobody wants to, like, scrub. So I said it needs to come off easily. So look. Voila. Super important to be able to come off, guys. So uh, Fab palettes, they are all on sale. You can get the Ilsi palette, the Margie palette, the Desine palette. You can get the Heather palette. Uh, that's me, right? Um, <laughs> I think. Uh, so you can get all of these palettes for only $15. Guys, these are great specials that I'm giving you. The Ilsi palette is, like I said, fabulous. 
And, uh, and I think you're really going to enjoy it. I think you're going to love these. And with that in mind, what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn it over to Ilse. She has a fabulous, beautiful butterfly lesson to teach you guys. Uh, so for those of you that want to get in the Christmas holiday spirit, I'm going to let Ilse teach you guys what I get my airbrush stuff ready so that we can do some airbrush tutorials. Okay. So stay tuned, guys. We have more on the way. All right. Okay. So far, so good. All right. Let me get you ready now. Let me get, I'll bring that chair over. I do have my stencils. Yeah, so we have a few minutes. Okay, You have to pee? Okay. I'm going to just move some of my stuff because... Okay. Okay. Hey, listen. Sandra's like, can you make me some shoes? Can you do that? I was like... Who? Yay! Perfect. You can start. What? Uh, you'll. You'll. I'm gonna do one on her, and then I'm so happy. You look great. How are you guys able to lose weight being home on quarantine? If you only knew. It's a lot of work. Oh, shit. Nobody saw that. Okay. Yay! Let me just move some of this stuff. And I just spilled water everywhere and blah, blah, blah. You need napkins? I have these. Oh, okay. I just, you know, trying to find places to put things. Nice stuff. So happy. How was your Thanksgiving? I was so different. Yeah. We, only, we went to, um... Then his parents. Oh, okay. It was just the four of us. But we didn't want to get all the family together. Yeah. So. Honestly, my sister was going to come down, and then my mom started getting all freaked out because they, um, they do, uh, they like go on all their soccer tournaments. And she's like, no, they're out everywhere. I don't want to be out. They just, it's fine. Let's have them here because then, you know, it won't be stressful. And, and I don't have to hear my mom. I don't have to hear. You know, even if I want to go to Daniel's parents' house because they're like older. So I don't and then, so we even got Tessa before just in case. I know. Because I was so afraid. Oh, hold on, hold on. Happened. They can hear me. Sorry, guys.
the inner corner of the eye as well. There you go. So we have a beautiful, full and spired, one-sided butterfly design for you. Okay guys, I hope you like the fall and blossom uh, butterfly design. Um, be sure to check out all these other amazing trends and all these other things. And please do check okay, press the space bar. Space bar. <laughs> Okay, guys, I don't know what happened with that tricky audio, but I'm going to have it fixed before uh, the next presentation from our next instructor. Will you turn that down just a little bit? Okay, so I am so excited because I was going to set everything up and I have everything for airbrush. So don't worry, guys, that's coming next. But, um, uh, you know, it's live and you never know what's going to happen live. I wanted to talk to you guys about something that's kind of like the elephant in the room and something that hopefully I can help inspire you through showing you how to do shoes, through talking to you about a couple of ideas that I have. So this is, I have a very special guest here in the studio. Oh, my me. Um, very, very special guest in the studio, which she'll be in in a few minutes. So. I want to talk to you guys about how to make money using your art. Now, I, if you don't know my background, I was a finance student in college. I did not study art at all. I took art and I hated it. I didn't like drawing fruit. Um, I didn't like people judging my art, but I was younger and, you know, way more emotional, I'm sure. So I did finance and I was a finance student. I took accounting one, two, three, cost analysis of a financial statement, um, which has helped me with my business in general. But I was never an art student. So what I mean by that is uh, my goal has always been through Silly Farm, through Faba TV to help you guys take what we're good at and make money doing it, right? So what I, the big point I'm trying to get to is you guys have a skill that not everybody has. Being able to create is not a gift that everybody is blessed with. I promise you. I meet people who can't even draw stick figures when we play charades. So the fact that our art opens so many doors for us, I just don't want you guys to underestimate, devalue what that means. So even though face painting is not a huge uh, busy business right now, it's dependent on events and people and wanting to get together and that's not where we are. It doesn't mean that you can't make money using our art. So um, I have a special guest. She's going to show you. So go to the one that says, make, I think it's make money too. It's on the, the third row. Uh, it was right after this one. It's up. Let me see if that's it. Sorry, guys. Okay. Yes. Okay. So um, this is called, so basically a lot of people, we had Cameron talk about it um, during our, uh, you know, when we had a, a business section on Faba TV, we had a full live power hour with a bunch of female entrepreneurs. So Cameron, Gio, Corinne Smith, all of our amazing Faba TV teachers really pivoted to doing yard cards, right? Because people want to celebrate. They just don't know how to celebrate right now. They haven't always seen yard cards. So one way that you can make money right now is doing yard cards, doing yard balloons, doing both, or offering a combination of one or the other. So I have a very special guest in the studio today. Uh, she is a Faba TV teacher. I fell in love with her the first time that I got a chance to meet her. She's a teacher a regular teacher, thank goodness for her. Um, we got to applaud all those teachers. And she's also a Faba TV teacher. So she has been so gracious to come over to Faba TV today and Silly Farm today and talk to us a little bit and show us a little bit about what she is doing to help make money, especially now, right, where we had to come up and get creative. So without further ado, Vanessa, come on over. Come on over. I'm so excited, guys. You can just go back to the blue background. Yeah, perfect. Come on over. All right. Okay. Come on over. Come on over. Okay. Yay. Okay. Hi, everybody. So we'll move. I'll move over a little bit this way because uh, we need to. Uh, let me move the camera. Hold on. Okay. You can tell everybody hi. Hi. How are you, everybody? I am Vanessa from Party Allure. So excited to be here today. Let me. Can you see it? Let's go back to 
I came here to show you guys some things that I'm doing. Uh, you can miss it? Okay. So something that I have been doing a lot of since, you know, the whole pandemic started uh, has been the balloon candy cups. And this has been a great addition. Like I have always done it before for like birthday parties, but with the pandemic, I think people were looking for something special to give to people. So um, I started selling them a lot for birthday parties in Halloween. I sold a lot of them. Um, and then now I'm getting ready for the holiday season, you know, trying to do something different um, to offer to those people. This one is like a little gingerbread and we have the reindeer. Um, and just to tell you guys a little bit, what do you need to make this? Um, I use these plastic cups that have a dome lid and this ones you can find them on Amazon or I also buy them in Sam's Club. So you can buy them like wholesale. So they come up really cheap, I think. They come up between like 17 cents to 20 cents per plastic cup. Um, and then all you need is buy a lot of candies. <laughs> and then I also, on Halloween, I learned that um, I put extra little things that I buy in Dollar Tree. So for example, this ones I found like little pens and it has like little booklets with like games, just something extra to add to the cup so it's not only candies. Um, and the feedback that I got from Halloween is like, everybody loved it. I put like little slime, um, little spider rings. Like I, I added more stuff and the people loved it. So I'm doing the same for the holidays. And and yeah, this is like, oh, my head been. <laughs> no. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, let's see if we both fit in here. All right. So let me tell you guys one other thing. You bought a stuffer, right? Yes, the a keepsake stuffer is like to make the big balloons where you can put everything inside, and it's just like a different way to give a gift that's because right. people can fit a lot of things in there. Um, some people give me the items, like they buy them and then they give it to me and then I just put it together for them uh, and then just pop in, the kid can pop in. Yes. Um, and then for Halloween, I did the piñatas where I will put a lot of candies, chocolates, little toys, everything in balloons. And then the people will hang it, like I will give them like a thing to hang in. And um, the kids loved it. It was such a different thing, and, and, and it sold really, really well. And let me tell you, she brought one. We ordered one from her for my son's birthday uh, because, obviously, it had to be scaled down. So uh, we you, she made us the balloon piñata. And let me tell you, these kids went crazy over it. And it was just such a brilliant idea. And that's what I've been trying to explain to everybody is that, you know, we have an artistic skill of being able to see a cup and turn it into something that you can sell and see a headband and turn it into something that you can wear. And then making these new pinata ideas, because a lot of people are nervous that maybe face painting's not coming back for a while, or, um, you know, that we can't do parties anymore. But you also in your Faba TV class talked a lot about, about your balloon deliveries correct mm -hmm. yes of like pre-making balloons that you can bring to people's house that you know so that they can pass them out at their drive by yes. yeah and that is a great idea guys because i've gone to in the past five months i've gone to like six drive-by parties okay so i can tell you that it would be nice instead of just giving someone a cupcake to eat in their car right because i yeah. had a cupcake in the car <laughs> and my kids ate it and it was all over the door and the handles and i was gonna just kill myself but having a balloon to give yeah. them is a great idea yeah. so that you're not you know just forced to just give somebody something you yeah. know that that is a waste but and then the first time i got hired to do balloon twisting actually at the drive-by so that when the cars will come i will ask the kid in the car like oh what do you want and i will make it but then um i i noticed that it would take a long time for all the cars to get the balloon so then after that experience i'm like okay no no i'm gonna make them all at home and i will put them in a pretty bag and i actually do a themed uh -huh. so for example i did a, a drive-by that it was like a dinosaur theme so i made all dinosaurs all different colors and different sizes uh so then the mom just gave them out to the kids in the cars and and they all loved them so Good that's idea. just you know something extra to to add like you can do any of this you can uh, you know, put it in a bag and then give it to them. You can also the, um, the balloon arrangements for birthdays Yes. Uh, where you add the number and you add the little, you know, if it's like a, I did one for like LOL dolls uh -huh. and I put the number and I did little LOL dolls in balloon. Uh, so it's something 
which you know such a super cute gift but not only that um you know you have a great class on fabric tv where she actually constructed the number which mm -hmm. i loved because for me it helped more so with the skill than anything else i haven't been twisting balloons in so long so for me it really really helped me to um you know just get those skills going again but would you say because you are gonna film a class on this not today right <laughs> but she is gonna film a class on some of these designs would you say like in order to be able to offer candy cups is it like a huge investment of time do you think with basic skills they can learn like four that they can sell right away totally totally like i mean the candy cups is like the easiest thing uh and it's like impressive to make because you can learn any design to put on top and you can put it on any candy cup and it's and all you need to buy is the plastic cups you need to have the candies and uh, and then you just get the 260 balloons. Normally, it's the ones that you are going to use the most. Uh, and any design that you can learn. And even now, they have these printed balloons. So, oh, for yes. example, for there is one that is like red and it has the Santa face. Oh. You could just put that here and then do like little bubbles on the side. And that's it. And you that's know, it. it's you can something you can offer and that people don't see um, too often, you know. And so, my next question to you is so these are not you know like i know the big um delivery balloon delivery some of the ones we've been seeing online are literally the equivalent of a wall yeah. and i don't know how people can transport them but do you have like a minimum for delivery do you make them pick it up from you just so that you know you can kind of maximize your time yeah i offer both uh, i tell people you can pick it up uh in my like in my building or i can deliver it to you but i do charge a delivery fee okay. if they pick that uh, i have had people just order one but they pay the delivery fee. So, you know, I just go and deliver it. Um, most of the people will order a few. Mm -hmm. um, in the, with the pandemic, I noticed that uh, people are ordering a lot for like, when they do small birthday party, maybe with like five, six kids, then they order five or six of this uh, just to give out like as like a party favor. Uh, so yeah, it's worth it. It is worth it. And that was really the point. And hopefully, I don't know if you have a few seconds to show them maybe a little sample. You know, we have another yeah. camera here. But um, I mean, this really, guys, today's little segment, this piece is just to help you guys remember that uh, Vanessa is a face painter. She airbrushes. So she's kind of obviously she does balloons. She teaches. Um, but you can use all of your skills one after the other, all in conjunction at the same time to do amazing work. And if you were not a creative person, you wouldn't be able to put the colors together. You wouldn't be able to say, okay, this looks good with a dome cup as opposed to just yeah, like a yeah. flat one. There's something about our skills of being creative and artistic that lend itself to being able to do things like this. And even though you might not be making the same exact money that you would face painting, right? Many of us were charging $100 an hour, $100 or more. The truth of the matter is if you sold four of these cups or three of these cups, that is what we are making an hour. And yes, you're still going to have to put in work of marketing and such. But at the end of the day, this is another way to make money without giving up on the things that we love. So if you have a few minutes, I would love yeah. to have you do a little demonstration. I will make one. Oh, yeah. I don't know which oh, one should I make, the gingerbread or the reindeer. Oh, I will I make one of them. Oh, God, I love both of them. Should I make the little reindeer? Maybe? The reindeer? <laughs> Okay, let me get all the balloons here, and I will make it for you guys. Just give me one second. You can use this camera right here. Um, this one, if you want to show anything up close. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. Perfect. Perfect. Let me just get this together. Okay, so we're going to make the reindeer, and for the reindeer, okay, so for the reindeer, for the, I love this one, it's super cute, um, and it's really easy to make and fast, and uh, I do put a little light on the nose, so uh, maybe you can't see it that well now, but like when the room is a little darker, like the nose will like uh, shine. I just need, okay, so for the reindeer, we're going to use uh, one 260 brown. We're gonna use a white 260. Um, and then for the nose, you can use like a five inch round in red. 
Um, this one actually I didn't have the round and I used like a heart balloon and I just shaped it into a, a circle. Or you can also use a little, uh, this is like a 350, so it's like the thicker one. And we're gonna use it to make that, uh, the little nose. Okay, so let me, we're gonna start with the brown. We're going to inflate it and make sure you like burp it by letting go of the air. And we're gonna inflate it kind of like leaving like a hand here. We're going to start with the mouth part. So we're gonna do, do, do you see it well here? Should I do it here? Oh, they're better? Okay. So we're gonna start with the nose. It's gonna be like a petal, uh, maybe like a three finger petal, just like this. And then this nozzle, you're gonna feed it through. Then we're gonna go up for the eyes. We're gonna do like a like a three finger bubble. Then we're gonna do a little bubble, like a one finger bubble. We're gonna fold it. You're gonna uh, like pull it and pinch it. And then we're gonna go down. So you're going to have, this is like the, the mouth, the two eyes here. We're going to attach later the little horns. We're going to go on the back and we're going to do a little pinch twist. We're just going to do a bubble. Just like this. Okay. So we have the little muscle and the pinches here on the back and the balloon comes down. We're gonna do like a little neck. We're gonna do the legs now. So the legs are kind of like a four finger bubble. We come back up and we twist it. And then I always like to do like a little pinches like in the neck, like a small one. And when you pull this, that way the, like, the head stays where it needs to be. And it doesn't move like too crazy. Okay, so we have the pinches there. We're gonna do the torso and then the two legs in the back, just like this. And then this little tail, you're gonna feed it through, just like this. Okay, um, you can leave it like this, or you can just twist through. So it's the little tail, like the little thing that they have here at the end. <laughs> uh, now we're gonna get the 260 wide. This is gonna be for the horn. Um, sometimes I use, there is like a balloon that is called, it's like ivory. Uh, but if you don't have that one, you could also use white for the horn. And what we're gonna do is gonna be a four finger segment. We're gonna do a pinch twist. You do the little bubble. Just like this. This one we're gonna do a little bit smaller. Okay. And this is what we're gonna attach to the little pinches that we have done here on the reindeer before. So we're just gonna circle it around. Just like that. And then we're gonna do the same. Now we're gonna do a little bubble, a pinch twist, and then we end up with the bigger segment. And this one. And then we're gonna cut the remaining of the balloon. Just gonna cut it. Okay, and I'm gonna cut this little part here too. There we go. Okay. So this is uh -huh. uh, this is like the body of the reindeer. Um, and now all we need to do is the little nose, okay? And again, if you have like a five inch red, that will be better. But if not, it's okay. We're gonna use uh, this 350, okay? So I'm going to cut it because we only need like the little uh, top here. And 
we're gonna add this one this i don't know i bought them on amazon it's like little lights <clears throat> let me show you here so it's a little light and when you remove this uh it just turns on and then you can put it inside the balloons um so this one i don't remember how i put it but I, if I remember the name, I will tell you guys later. Uh, but it's just like a little small light. And, the, and then you're going to put it inside. And the other thing, okay. So you can like stretch this out and put it in. But I also have this uh, tool that I bought on Amazon. If you put a balloon expander um, on Amazon, you're going to find this. So all you need to do is you need to put the balloon inside. And then this opens. And you can fit the light really easily in there. Just like that. We're going to inflate the balloon now. We just want a little end. We're going to let go of the air and tie it. Okay. I don't need all this here, so I'm just gonna cut it. So then all we have to do is you're gonna grab this and you're gonna feed it through here. And then this little part, you take it to the end and you're gonna wrap it around, just like this, okay? And then that's it. This is the little reindeer. Now all we need to do is draw the little face and all we're gonna do is two little eyes. So I'm gonna put it here. We're gonna do two circles. A little here. Sometimes I have to put it the other way to draw the other circle. Okay. And then we're gonna draw the little mouth, a little smile. And I also have this editing. Uh, it's like a white paint marker that I love. I need to buy a new one. But you would just do like a little dot here for the eye and then like a little uh, on the nose. And then that's it. This is the little reindeer. So as I was saying before, any uh, balloon design that you can do, you can attach it really easily to this. So all I did for this is that I grabbed like any balloon. Uh, you don't need like a whole balloon, but normally I use my my scraps and then you're gonna fit in here through this leg you're gonna fit it through the other leg just like this and then this you're going to attach it to the flower okay so when you attach it to the flower then that's how it, it stays like that standing okay um so yeah, this is the reindeer. I hope you guys like it. I will be recording a class on uh, balloon candy cups with more designs, like holiday designs. Um, I have one that is like a dreidel and the kids love that one because I actually make it uh, where they can twist like twirl it and play with the dreidel. Uh, so it's really cute. So stay tuned for that class soon. That's right. So thank you so much, Vanessa. I love you so much. Not only is she a fabulous balloon artist, face painter, airbrush artist, she's also an amazing teacher. She helps my son so much. I know if he saw you here, he would like <laughs> flip out, flip out. So I want to say thank you so much. That's for nice. those of you that don't know, go to Vanessa's channel. It is an amazing channel. We love having her. She was going to teach at Fabeg 2021, but now it's going to be Fabeg 2022. 22, yes. And by that time, you're going to be even better. You're <laughs> yeah. going to like blow everybody away. Um, but truthfully, guys, with as with all the Faba TV instructors, they're all here to help you. When they teach, they teach from a place of love and that they want to help you get better. So if you have questions about what she's charging, please reach out to Vanessa. Reach out to me. We'll be happy to help yeah. you, um, you know, just grow your art and get better at it so yeah. that you don't have to give it up. So thank you, Vanessa. Yeah, I love course. you thank so you for much. Having me. Happy holidays. Thank you. Okay. And this was such a great tool. I'm going I to go know. buy it. I was like, I Ooh. use those too when I want to put little candies inside the balloon. Yes. You can this use that thing, too. So. See, just by tuning in today, guys. Amazon. <laughs> okay. All right, Vanessa, have the best thank holidays. You. Hold on, Marcella. Hold on one second. Thank oh. you. Thank you. Isn't she the best, guys? Okay. So um, Vanessa, awesome Today's going to be full of surprises. I promise to fix that audio issue. Just give me one second. Um, so, so that was my first tip, right, on how to make money. Um, if you want to learn more about 
balloons about business about marketing about creating graphics i encourage you guys to join fava tv we have two amazing specials going on this weekend both of them include a gift card that you can use at silly farm you can use towards fabaic if you want to um so to help you bring it down so it all kind of comes to the same place we have the best instructors on fava tv so you can take advantage of two different specials um depending on your budget one go ahead you can put it through one one is 250 and that's for a year it includes a gift certificate and graphics and graphics marketing material you're going to be able to download up to six of them a month that will be a library for you to use if you tell me heather i'm not great at designing i don't know how to put together ads you don't have to now your fava tv subscription comes with access to graphics that you can customize it's the template it's designed for you it's drag and drop i will teach you how to use all of them and i promise you it's going to help you to improve your social media it's going to help you to market better and faster and we're going to do a whole demo today, so don't worry about that. The second one, if you don't have 250, you have 125, and it also has a gift card, so you can like treat yourself to Susie's cakes. You can watch Vanessa all day. You can watch Nick Nick Wolf. You can watch Ilse. You can watch Marcella Bustamante, Marcella Mira. You can watch me. You can at, watch the hundred teachers on Faba TV: Acacia, Gio. Um, Oh my God, Ginny, Mateo, Nick, Brian, Jocelyn, you name it, they are on Faba TV. So please go over to fabatv.com, subscribe, join the family. All right, so you can get rid of that one and then go back to money two. So clear the first layer and then go to money two and yes. Okay, so here's another idea. So we're back back to um, ways to make money doing your art. So the first one was doing yard cards in balloons. Now I don't do yard cards. So naturally it's great to link up with someone in your area, start offering those services. We contract Vanessa, I call her up, I give her business. Why? Because it's the gift that keeps on giving. So she can help me book parties, I can use her services. So just link up with someone if you're not already doing it and you be the planner, you be the facilitator. Um, that is a job, guys. So just keep that one in mind. The second one is um, I probably owe a lot of the credit to Marcella. She had been doing library shows for many years in South Florida. And when we had to go online because they weren't offering them, she asked me to put her shows online. And through doing her shows online, I was able to get better at the process and understand it and learn how to use Zoom and to use microphones. And because of that, I've been able to sell virtual classes to both the library and to the YMCA. So Silly Farm sells these kits, okay, that include pre sketched uh, canvases. They come with paint and the paint that you need and brushes. They're all packaged individual so that you can right now contact your customers, plant the seed in their mind about things that they can offer for their parties. They can put together a little paint kit, give it to everybody at the drive-by, and then later on that night have an online birthday party where you go on for an hour and you show them how to paint a canvas and you sing happy birthday together. I'm a mother. I can guarantee you that I want someone to do those things for me because I'm tired and this pandemic has put a lot of strain on us to become creative and to think outside the box and to find ways to make our kids happy. So literally, we put together these kits for you. They're like $7. It's a pre-sketch canvas and you can sell them to your customers for 12 and 15 and you give it to them and they can pass it out at their drive-bys and then that night again you just tell them it comes with a one hour zoom class you sing happy birthday you paint along you engage the only thing you need truthfully is you can do it with your cell phone you don't even need to have um a camera equipment like this you can do it with your laptop oh that was my phone sorry guys um, you can do it with your laptop. I don't know who's calling. Um, so there, the possibilities are endless by way of seeing what you can offer. Uh, so that's my little thing on virtual parties. If you need more help with that, reach out to me. I can explain some things. If you need help with StreamYard, reach out to Dee. She is the champion of StreamYard and she can really help you guys. Okay, so last but not least on how to make money. Like I said, many of us, it's money three. Yep, many of us, are very gifted okay many of us i'm going to introduce you to the most gifted of them all in just a few minutes um 
most of us have gifts that we didn't even know. Melina Kilpatrick, those are her t her cookies in the corner right here, okay? She said that she took an online class on how to make cookies. And within two weeks, she made and learned how to make these cookies and turned it into a business. You guys have gifts that you should not underestimate or devalue. Marcella, who, come on over here. Come on over here, cutie pie. Look at how cute she is. Who else do you know can wear uh, pigtails and still look this can I cute? Stay from that, or I'm high enough. You're high enough. I mean, okay. yeah, you're fine. Okay, so Marcella has just like many of us. What happened? We ended up losing everything. No, <laughs> no not no. everything. We're healthy. Just we're a, alive. That's right. Okay, just a lot of work. Just a lot of work, but she loves hearts. As long as I've known her, she's always loved hearts. And what did you decide to do or what have you been doing lately? Okay, well, I've been into beading for a while. I started a couple of years ago just beating the ends of my plant holders just to make them prettier and cuter and hippies. And then, you know, when this uh, happened, then I started putting beads on anything I found. So I made lamps, I made candle holders, I made mobiles and everything, you know, wind chimes, you name it, I made it. But those are like pretty big. So then for Christmas, I decided, you know, why don't I just make a couple of Christmas ornaments? So I started making Christmas ornaments and hopefully, uh, not yet, not okay, yet. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> Next Saturday, uh, we're going to have a little market, holiday marketplace here. And hopefully a lot of people will come and buy them because it's a very inexpensive gift that you can give somebody or give yourself and your tree. And I put hearts on everything because hearts means I love you. So when you give a gift to somebody that has a heart, then that means that you love them. So let me show you some of the little ornaments that I made. Can we use this camera to show uh, them? Yep. So okay. We'll switch to that okay. One, Lisa. So like I said, yeah, can you see it? And switch the camera to okay, like so um, that there. one. Yep. Okay. All of them, you know, they all have uh, sparkles, crystals on it. So when you have crystals on the ornament, what happens is if the when the Christmas tree lights touches them then, you know, then they're going to sparkle, you know. And one thing that I do is that I never make any uh, two the same. All of my little ornaments are one of a kind. And because um, I just keep making and I just keep coming with more ideas. Uh, this one I made for my wonderful neighbors because they're like the best neighbors ever, you know, and they love rainbows. And, uh, you know, all of them have, uh, some of the hearts are puffy, some of the hearts are not. And every, and every day, you know, like I pick one up and then I pick up my beads and I just start putting them together. This one, I put a butterfly on it for somebody that likes a butterfly. This one just have crystals. And again, when you hang this on your Christmas tree, then the lights are going to hit it and you're going to have tiny little rainbows on your tree. So what's better than love and rainbows? You know, so let me show you a couple more. Then I'm gonna show you something else that I came up with. And how do they okay. how do they buy them from you? Um, good question. <laughs> I'm I'm terrible at I'm not like Heather when it comes to marketing. I was gonna open up this one is pretty. I was gonna open up the little Etsy store, then I realized it's like really complicated. I love making them, but um don't like marketing. So if you want one, uh, just call me, just PM me. You know, this one sells for $10. Uh, some of the ones that I saw at the store, they sell for the same price. They're not as unique or as pretty. So um, a couple more, and then I'm going to show Modesty you a couple other things. In our family. <laughs> no, they are really beautiful. You've got to lay it flatter. Look, yeah. look, look at those, uh, those sparkles. Okay, so then then what happened was that my, my sister, okay, that one, uh, my sister gave me this little angel like and she says can you make a pull for my for my fan because I can't reach it so I said sure and then when I walked into her house the first thing that I saw was this beautiful little pull for her fan and so I decided to start making some of them so for example this one can you see it uh, do I do I need to back up okay yeah, lower it okay but I can lower it because it touches this just like make it in the back Okay, so anyway, so this one it has this little chain in the top, so you can hang this uh, from your fan and use it as a fan pull, but you can also hang it from your window, like a window prisms, because that's what I do a lot of, you know, I do a lot of uh, window 
window prisms. Your right whole there. house is full of them. Yeah, but you know what? People go to my house and they see all, in the morning when the sun hits the windows, they see all the rainbows. And especially kids, they always think I have a magic room or a magic house. And then what happened was I said, okay, well, I want to do something uh, a little bit smaller so that I can sell it a, a, for a little bit less for people that just want to give something unique and small. Uh, so these ones right here are keychains. So, you know, I made them real small so you can they can keep them on the, on the purse. It has a heart. It has crystals. means you love them. Uh, this, two, this one has a little um, palette. Somebody had given me this, and it was a pair of earrings. So um, I just turned them into a little keychain. Then I have one more. And this one also was a, a pair of earrings with the, that I lost one of them with the cherries. I have to put the ring on this one. So these are these are keychains, but you know what? I will make you anything. Like for example, uh, Heather's sister Emily, uh, she, they went away for her birthday, and they went to a winery, and she got a cork from her expensive wine, and somebody signed it that says "Happy Birthday, Happy Thirtieth Birthday." So I took her cork and I made her a beautiful hanging like this one using the cork. Uh, somebody else sent me a family heirloom that was a, a necklace from her mother, but it wasn't her style and it was a little too big and gothic for them. So I also made them into a, a window prism. So now that she hangs it on the window, it makes them rainbows. It's got a heart and it's got her mother's uh, pendant in there so she can remember her and how much she loved her every day. So if you have any ideas, just let me know. And then maybe one day I will teach a class on Fava TV on, on how to do these beads. So you can do them That's too. Right. Okay, go back to camera one for us. Yes. yes. Okay. So this is what I mean about using your skills. A lot of us are just so nervous about the unknown because many of us don't know what's going to happen, right? Some days you feel like everything's great. And then the next day it's like watching the news and you just want to stay inside of your bubble. So the beautiful part is that all of us who are artists have great skills that you can transfer into different areas. Lisa, many of you know, um, she's the owner of Zen Love Bliss. She makes the most beautiful bracelets on the planet, Marcella and I. Yeah. I'm so mad I took Look, mine off so I didn't get no, airbrush on them. No, me. I um, never leave home without them. Never leave home without <laughs> them. Um, but she has a great special going on, so definitely go follow Zem Love Bliss. And she was able to take her eye of face painting and turn that into jewelry and crystals and being able to photograph crystals, right? Um, the list goes on. If you go back to the slide, uh, Lisa, with the one money three in the background. Um if you see behind me, uh, Jasmika, she's in, I believe, in Connecticut. She makes the most beautiful resin coasters, and the, her color combinations are so gorgeous. And Scarlett also does uh, balloon deliveries in the Chicago area, and she's doing, you know, filling the balloons as well. So with your gifts, you guys can make money. Like, I'm proud of Marcella. Go order from Marcella yeah. right now. And PM, you know DM and her. Even if you don't want to make a lot of things for sale like this uh christmas and hanukkah is coming and you know you're always so used to giving your own family gifts so this is something that you can make for them they yes. won't take you that long it won't cost you much and they would like really appreciate it i would i love Mar marcella made me a uh one a little basket with hearts on it and i hung it outside of my house and everybody stops yeah. and asks me where i got it from so and her mom was my first uh Paying customer. Paying customer. She bought a whole bunch of these. That's right. Tea. Well, I thank you so much, Marcella. You're we welcome. love you. And everybody, if you want heart inspired art, uh, reach out to Marcella. If you want these fabulous cookies, uh, you can reach out to Melina. There's so many possibilities, guys. And I can talk to you all day about them. And we are. But now I'm going to show you another possibility, which is called airbrush. That's why I got my glove on. I I'm, I guarantee you I'm gonna lose a nail by the end of this or <laughs> so the end of the. Uh, they're, but, not, they're not real nails. No, Lisa hooked me up. Aren't Lisa, they? you were supposed to hook me up. Okay, I can lend you mine. <laughs> okay. 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 Bye, Mark. All right. Bye, everybody. Okay. 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 All right. So come on over here, Ashley. Okay. So with airbrushing, you can sit here. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. So you're going to face this way. No, okay. I'm going to figure out how to. Uh, uh, no, I'm going to. You're going to swing it around. I'm going to oh, figure okay. out how to position you. Okay. I think that there's an airbrush background. 
Uh, guys, we're getting there, okay? I don't remember. I was like doing things at one o'clock in the morning, two o'clock in the morning. So if it's spelled wrong, uh, I apologize. No, maybe. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Um, okay, no. Okay, we're just going to keep on going with it. All right, so I told you guys a little bit earlier when I talked to you about the airbrush special that airbrushing has changed my life in many ways. It's helped me specifically now more than ever because I've been offering more airbrush services of shoes, of hats, um, and I have been getting calls for people to do airbrush tattoos, and that's kind of the only art that I'm doing right now because I'm able to, yes, that's it. Excellent. Um, that's the only art I'm doing right now because it's the one that's the most comfortable for me that I can wear my mask. I can, you know, limited touch on people and I feel a little bit more comfortable because I don't have to get as close. Um, so I love airbrushing. Uh, and with your airbrush system, you can do a lot of different things. We're going to be doing shoes in a minute uh, to show you guys my little hack. And then I'm going to show you guys the wiser stencils. I'm, Ashley donated her arm to me. I'm so grateful um, because you know, it's not that easy all the time to find models. I, we're working with a very small number of people here, guys, at Silly Farm. So uh, thank you to my team for sticking with me uh, through this whole thing because it has been a very interesting year. So with airbrushing, the main thing that you need to know is I highly recommend taking a class uh, even one of the classes on Fava TV, just one class before you invest in a system. So you can see if you're going to be willing to clean your equipment, what it takes, what do you need in terms of a table setup and such. Some people love the idea. They don't love the work. But I guarantee you, if you are a person who doesn't mind, you know, setting up, cleaning and maintaining your stuff, you will make money airbrushing because there's a lot of different things behind me. You can see. You can do tattoos, you can do shirts, you can do hats, you can do shoes, you can airbrush cakes, you can airbrush nails and makeup and body paint all with the same system. You don't have to have different systems. The only thing you're going to change is the paint because what you would use on shoes, you're not going to use on the skin. So with airbrushing on the skin, there's two types of paints. There's ink and there's hybrid, and there is water-based, but we're not gonna talk about that now. We're gonna talk about ink and hybrid. So ink is waterproof. So if you do events outside, if you have a lot of adult clients who want paint to be waterproof, ink will do that for you. If you just want something that's gonna look really good and last until they wash it off with soap and water, then you can use hybrid. And I personally like using the hybrid because it dries right away on the skin, like almost immediately, which allows me to layer very fast and also very good to use when you're working with the wiser stencils, which we're going to do a demonstration right now. Is there any questions? I know that usually with airbrushing, there's a lot of questions. It's like, I don't know. I love it. I'm scared. It's a lot of money. Um, but if you think about it, most people who airbrush are charging are collecting at minimum $200 per event. That's at minimum because it's more work. So usually we charge more. So if you figure it out, you can pay it off after like eight parties, which is not that much when we're busy, right? Like I've done sometimes three parties in one day. I was tired, yes, but I have done it. Okay, any questions? Marcella's monitoring us. If you have questions, guys, please chat. Now's the time to ask. It's me here. It's Ashley here. She airbrushes, correct? Mm -hmm. You love to airbrush, right? Yep. I'm not just putting her on the spot. <laughs> okay. So Wiser makes these. Wiser change the game. Just like when we released Artie Cakes and Rainbow Cakes, I think that we didn't realize how fabulous it was going to be and what it was going to do for our community until... We released them. Wiser created these, which if you haven't seen them, they're called Tattoo Pros, and they are realistic looking tattoos. And the upside to them is that they're incredible and your customers go crazy over them. The downside to them is if you're like me, an artist, they have all these small pieces and I lose everything. So that's the only downside. I have to find a way to not be so messy, um, but... Good luck with that one. Anyways, so essentially what happens is you're going to be using the negatives. And the cool thing about Tattoo Pros is that you really don't even have to use any color besides black with it. Now, I like color, so I add a lot of color, but you can embellish with either color or you can embellish with glitter, which is also something I like to do. So 
when they come, when they arrive, they're going to arrive in one big sheet and you're going to just disconnect the little pieces. Please don't throw this away. This is essential. This is all of the little extras that go with the kit. So don't get rid of it. Keep it. And if you take care of it, it is going to last forever and ever and ever if you don't let it blow away or if you don't lose things like me. I mean, I'm transparent with you guys. I'm not perfect. My mom tells everybody how messy I am all the time. Okay, I'm going to rearrange this camera. So if you'll go to the this camera for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, hold on one second. Sorry, guys. I just want to make sure that I have Ashley and go to camera, the detail one. Uh, in, in row two? Mm-hmm. Perfect. Don't worry. I don't need to be on there. Okay. So this gun that I use is a dual action gun. Okay. And what that means is if you press down, you get air. If you pull back, you get paint. So I personally like to use the Iwata brand and my compressor isn't on. Hence why nothing was coming out. Okay, so I like to use the Iwata brand. It's my favorite uh, because it's a really well-made gun. It's heavy. And when I mean heavy, I don't mean like super heavy. What I mean, it's balanced so that when you're spraying, it doesn't feel like the paint is here, but the gun is going to tip over. So it's a very nice, well-designed gun. I like to use bottom feed because I can use a two-ounce bottle that connects so I don't have to keep on refilling uh, my, my top feed gun. Sorry if it feels like I'm feeling on your booty. <laughs> I apologize. <laughs> okay. So what you do is you're going to just start spraying around the edges. Okay. So all I'm going to do is spray directly around the edges of my stencil and inside. And notice I can't if I spray over my finger, I'm going to have a piece of my finger on there. So all you have to do is just hold it and kind of walk your fingers around. Don't feel the need to have to hold everything down at once. Now you're going to have to turn to me a little bit. And I'm going to just spray again around. And what your goal is, is for you to just kind of spray this light haze this is going to be an interesting tricky angle but you're spraying kind of like a light haze just around the outside okay so when you lift it off you see what you get you get this super awesome realistic looking tattoo so that's the cool part about it is that even at the most basic level if you're not going to go in and shadow or shade or add anything else this looks good all on its own then you take it up a notch with all of the fun different accessories. Like this obviously doesn't go with the skull kit, but I still like to combine everything because that's what I like to do. And that's part of being a face painter, right? Is that you have this eye that gets to see what you can do and create with different pieces, right? So it's not just, I'm gonna just use one piece of the set, everything has to match, everything has to look like it's uniform. No, you can go crazy, you can have fun, you can combine different pieces. Like this piece is like, what do you do with that? Well, it's part of this set, which is the Electro Skull. And I can, sorry, Ashley. Yeah, she's like, uh, don't worry. Well, I'm working at a crazy angle, guys, but that's okay. She doesn't mind that I'm cutting her face off with this stencil. So you see how I'm able to get these different effects and to be able to combine, if you can turn a little bit more this way. So if I do one lotus flower here, naturally what I would want to do is balance it out. So if, well, yeah, sorry if you're in a little bit of pain. So I'm just going to move around. Okay, so you see how now I'm building. Oh, you gotta, where am I going? Where am I going? Okay, so you see how now I'm building. Let's move you back this way. This tattoo, you see how simple, how you don't need, guys, a whole lot of skill. You don't need to be the best artist in the world. You just have to get creative. And that's the beautiful part about airbrushing is that you can get creative. 
you can make your designs come alive by just using your creativity. Because whenever, and look at within a matter of five minutes, I was able to do almost a full sleeve, right? And what does that do for you? One, it makes you look like a super cool artist that has lots of skills because if somebody wasn't watching you do this, what are they gonna say? Oh my God, how did she do that? That's really cool, that's incredible, that looks amazing. And then that makes you look like you're better at your job. It makes you look like you know what you're doing. And, uh, and all of the above. You can also use all of these little extra pieces to add shadows and to shade inside to get as detailed as you want to. You could create a background. Obviously, we don't have tons of time today. But the second thing that I wanted to show you guys is how you can get just as creative by using and adding glitter. So this is a glitter cream, and it already has kind of that uh, Vaseline or cocoa butter base to it, so it sticks. So in all of those sections that have uh, a lot of black, like if you wanted to tone it down, you can just put down this glitter cream. I need it like a step ladder. So what happens when you're uh, not that tall. Okay, so I would just put down some glitter cream and then you can mix in uh, some fine glitter. This is the Mama Clown glitter. And if you combine it with the glitter cream, look what it does. This one has like, I don't know if you guys can see uh, the blue tint to it. And you see how beautiful that is? It just pops. Uh, this one is, yeah, this one's brilliant blue. And you see what that does? It doesn't make it too, too, like, girly. It doesn't take away how awesome it is. But you see what a little bit of glitter does to take your design to the next level? You have a question, Marcel? Yes. Yes. Uh, Ines Hernandez, she wants to know where to get more information on the airbrush. Excellent question. So Ines, I know you can switch me back over. Thank you, Ashley. Everybody give Ashley a round of applause. Yay. Excellent. I love her. Okay. We'll show you one more time before you leave. Uh, show, show, let's show your arm. See you guys. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Awesome. Thank you, Ashley. Okay. Yeah. She did so great. Um, okay. So, um, where can you learn about airbrushing right now going on on Faba TV? We have em amazing specials. I have a class on Faba TV called Money in the Air. I have an airbrush class, uh, how to clean your airbrushes. Cliff Turner teaches you the difference between compressors and CO2 tanks. Uh, Donna Nowak, Estefa Pinares, Avi teaches one of the best classes on Faba TV on texturing, like creating textures like wood grain. He saved me for Halloween. We can we teach you abs. Du oh, Dutch doesn't have an airbrush class. Um, but if I tell you Jesse Thorinson, the amazing artist on Faba TV who will help you, Wiser, the creator of Tattoo Pros, uh, shows you how to use, uh, and I have classes just from basic, basic, basic. One month of Faba TV is $24. So if you want to spend $24 to take as many airbrush classes as you want to become proficient, to learn how to clean your kit, um, to learn about the different guns, that's the only investment I suggest you make before you spend $2,000 on an airbrush system. Because for those of you that didn't know, um, you have the airbrush special, right? That one. Today and this weekend, while supplies last, I don't have that many kits. I believe we only have, no, the airbrush system. Um, we only have a few in stock. Uh, we have a very special, special price going on this weekend only for the airbrush system. You get a free flag and you get a free ultrasonic cleaner. Now, I promise you just the ultrasonic cleaner alone is worth it. It's worth it your time, everything, because you're with a kit this big that includes this much stuff, uh, this much stuff, this much stuff, sorry, um, there you can literally clean all your guns at one time. It's going to help you. It's a time saver. So you get, you're going to get your full airbrush system, six guns, compressor, hoses, paint, a case, an ultrasonic cleaner to clean everything, a hundred plus stencils, your banner and a flag. This is a complete business system, guys. This is, 
you can build your own system piece by piece. And I will not tell you not to do that, but it is a lot easier when you get all your pieces at one time and you don't have to figure out how to connect everything. We will do that for you. So please, uh, if you want to learn to airbrush, go to Faba TV. If you want to buy the best system on the planet, this is it, guys. This is the best one. Okay. So let me show you guys about shoes. Okay. Um, so I was hired to do shoes. And one thing that's so scary about shoes is that or doing fabric in general is that there, you, there's no room for mistake, right? Like if you mess up, you mess up. And here's a funny story. Uh, one time I was doing a birthday party for a heat player and, you know, it was like a big birthday party and he had a video camera and all that stuff, like super fabulous. And then he comes over with the video cameras and it's time for me to do his son's uh, shirt. And he's standing over me and the cameras are going and I spelled his kid's name wrong right in front of the cameras. And he was so nice. He goes, you spelled his name wrong. And I almost died. Like my hands started shaking. Everything in my brain started hurting because I spelled his son's name wrong and they had to refilm it. Ugh, it was awful. But that's happened. And for those of you that have done Uggs before, right? Uggs does promotions all the time at the mall where they want us to paint on their Uggs. If that's not so stressful, you can't mess up someone's Uggs. They're like $200. You'll lose all your money that way. So I have always been looking for fast and fun ways to like improve my airbrush setup and do a better job at doing airbrushing, lettering, because lettering can be a little tricky. So two tricks or two must-haves or two things that are going to save your life. One, let me explain the paint. So go to the detail camera. Okay. First, number one. Uh, oh, why am I? And then go to, yeah, perfect. And let me, let me fix the camera. Sorry, guys. Okie dokie. All right. First and foremost, you have to have this. Well, first, this is the paint that I use. I use Createx airbrush colors. Um, it is made for textiles, so it's not going to come off. They are about $4.99 a bottle. Uh, for two ounces, so it's not so, so expensive, which is good. Uh, comes in every color under the sun, pearlized, neons. I mostly use neons because I think that they look the best. Uh, but do not attempt to airbrush on clothing or anything without this. This is the regulator. It thins it out. So why I didn't know about this sooner, who knows? I should have called Rich Diltz. He's so good. Or um, uh, my man up in Chicago. Eric Styles, I should have called you guys, should have at least told me. Anyways, this thins out the paint because um, the paint is thick and it needs to be thinned many times. There are certain colors that are fine. Otherwise, you need to thin it. So I like to thin it and then that way I can get a nice smooth um, consistency when I flow through my brush. The other thing is you cannot clean this or clean Createx with alcohol or water. You have to clean it with their cleaner or with Windex. Please do not make the mistake of putting water in it because you'll ruin it and you'll hate your life and you can't clean it and it's the worst thing in the world. You had a question, Marcella? No. Okay, perfect. Marcella's making these hand it's gestures. Safe, safe, safe. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be there. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, so here is my, if, if you do nothing else today, I hope that you take this advice and you love me for it. I used to try to airbrush freehand, and I still do many times. Depends on the surface. So when you're doing a shirt, look at the space that you have, right? You have this whole space. This is even bigger than a kid's um, face. So you have room to freestyle to, I don't want to say make a mistake, but you just have more room. When you're working on... Um, on shoes or hats, it's much smaller. So I started going to Hobby Lobby and getting these packages of letter stickers, okay? They're $3.99 and you know Hobby Lobby always has coupons um, and they come in every style you can think of. I like this style. There's these fun style. There's every style you can think of. I have cursive ones that was this set. 
And then what I do is whenever I'm doing shirts, hats, whatever, I always have an assistant with me. So what my assistant does is they take names and put the stickers on so that I can just spend my time getting creative, which is so important, guys, because this can be very stressful and you don't want people bothering you because then what happens is that you'll ruin something and you can't fix it. So my assistant puts stickers down and puts the names on and then gives them to me. And then all I have to do is just paint at that point. So when you're working with your airbrush, is airbrush tattoos, or I'm sorry, airbrush clothing and such, I always have a towel nearby. Why? Because you want to make sure that you spray, that you test it, that you make sure it's working, that you know if you need to thin anything out. Like I said, I like to use the fluorescent colors because they're really pretty. And those are the ones that I like to use. So what you would do is if you want to make sure they're absolutely perfect, get some painter's tape to just cover the, the, uh, the sole area because you don't want. So then I'm just going to start airbrushing and go right over those stickers. Okay, and this is going to save some of you guys who are like struggling so bad. Like, how do I do shoes? How does everything? It's so small. I can't see. Like, even now I need to put on my glasses and I'm fighting it because when did I turn into that person who needs their glasses to see? That's what happened. Okay, so look, I'm just kind of airbrushing, blending. Look at how beautiful those colors are. Nice and bright just like that. And then how many of you own every stencil under the sun? I do. Look at this fabulous stencil. This is part of the quick easy collection. And I love this stencil. It's such a good accent stencil when you're doing shirts and such. So I'm going to just finish blending this one all out with yellow. And this is a yellow mixed with gold, I believe. Because, you know, us face painters, doesn't this look like a beautiful rainbow cake, guys? Oh, so magnificent. And then it add just a little bit more. Look. Ooh, so look at how beautiful that is, okay? Just make it your own. And look at how much faster this is than having to write and getting the word B really perfect on this tiny shoe that's, like, not the easiest uh, thing to airbrush on. So... Usually what I like to do is just in the back using this same stencil. Now, one thing is the reason I have a towel, I don't like to waste paper towels. They're very expensive right now and not as available at Publix. There was no toilet paper or, or uh, paper towels the other day. So I always have a it's towel. Like store. Yeah, but it's so thin. You need to use the whole roll to wipe your butt. <laughs> okay, so if you what what more uh, anyways, okay, so now what I'm gonna do in the back is just kind of mimic a little bit of what I did in the front, but this time using the stencil. So I just hold it and wrap it. And then again, just kind of keep on going all the way to the top. Okay, and you see how cool that looks? See, guys, how you can add. Now, the rest is up to you. You can kind of go back in and fade out the sides if you want. That's up to you. I mean, you know, you got to figure out what you want to do. Um, I encourage you to figure out what you like. You can put more of their name right there. And look, look at how fast and simple that you can do shoes. Then you're just going to peel off the stickers Okay, look, I know, right? I know, I'm a genius, what can I say? I'm getting, I get all my modesty from Marcella. Look at how cute these are, Marcella. And all, you, yeah, these nails are coming in super handy. Go Lisa, me and my Lee press ons, so happy. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna do manicures and pedicures right after this. Okay, see what I mean, guys, how fast and easy. Now, maybe if you want to have like tweezers by you, if you don't have your own Lee press-ons, but I'm going to lift that one up. 
and look look at how cute these shoes are guys look you can have your own pair and what does the other side say be happy so we're just gonna do this side same exact thing and well so far a lot of the people hiring me happen to be department stores to do this but if you're gonna do custom sneakers i wouldn't charge less than 40 dollars to set up my stuff so and then you can choose to buy these shoes yourself like i got these shoes at walmart for five dollars I've seen people spend a lot more money on shoes. Like when I was doing it at the mall, they were charging $60 for blank vans. What? $60 for some white shoes? Like how long do shoes actually stay white? That just seemed like highway robbery to me. Oh, my God. Simona Rad. Whew. Oh my goodness. Okay, guys, this was an important lesson. Look what happened. I put the stencil down and I put it on the wrong side. So what happened? I got some paint right there. How do you fix that? You can't. So you got to, now you got to fade it up more to help cover that a little bit more because I laid it down and that was my bad. And you got to remember that. That's again, why I have my little towel right by me. Even people who do a lot of work, they make mistakes. So you got to just keep on going. Now, I remember I was at a bat mitzvah. This is a true story. And the little girl came up to me and she startled me. And by accident, I sprayed her. This is the bat mitzvah girl. Sprayed her dress and her. I got paint all over her dress. And this was her answer to me. It's okay. I hated this dress. My mom made me wear it. And I was like, no, 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 no. Like, I sprayed your dress. I got black all over your dress. Your mom's going to kill me. And she goes, no, 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 no. I don't care. I hate this dress, whatever. It's just for tonight. Thank God I left her with my cell phone number for her mom to call me because I couldn't find her mom. Her mom called me, cursing me out. I said, listen, I gave your daughter my number because I wanted to apologize and I'll buy you a new dress. The mom was like, oh, no, that was just the nice thing. Thank you. It's like people who hit your car and leave a note. I think her mom was just great, grateful that I that I cared. So long story short, you do not want to uh, spray people's clothes because there's no redos, okay? Look at how cute these are coming out. Are these my size? Yes! Oh, I just made myself a Christmas gift. Yay! <laughs> Any uh no the paint does not dry right away the paint needs okay there's two ways to set this paint heat set it so what i do for shirts if i don't want to iron people's stuff while on the job is i just tell people put it in the dryer for 10 minutes the heat seals it the otherwise it'll air dry on its own in like 15 minutes and it depends on how hot it is if you're outside it'll dry even faster but I like to give people a chance to let it dry before. All right, look at this, guys. Oh my goodness, these are so cute, aren't they? Yes. Is anybody a size I seven? Can make them in seven on mine too. You can listen if you. I will tell you guys. Look at these guys. Oh my goodness! Be happy. Look at these shoes. You can make these in any colors that you want. Okay. You guys can do this. These are stencils. This is a nice gift. I am making all of my nieces shoes for Christmas. I, when I was doing the mall event, I had six parents see this going on and went and bought baby vans. They spent $45 on baby vans and had me personalize them. It was one parent after another customizing shoes for their kids. Why? Because they like it. These were like baby, baby vans, like this big. Oh my God. But as a face painter, these are so cute, right? You could make your own shoes. Now, um, uh, Createx does make a sealer if you want a, it's a clear coat. I don't have it here with me or I would have done it that you can spray. It's just like when we do our uh, airbrush tattoos or sealers for your face paint. It's the same exact idea. So you would just spray it and let it dry. I tell people to put it inside of the dryer. But you see, I think that 
for so these were like i said five dollars at walmart i think that this is a great gift i think that's a very fun gift i'm so excited about them and obviously you can do them in any color that would be and you can do them to any theme right because most of us already own every stencil under the sun like i think i have a collection of at least ten thousand stencils so i hope that you guys um, remember how much I love you and shared my Hobby Lobby secrets with you guys, okay? Because sharing is caring. And I'm confident that you guys can do something really fun and get even more creative and make some really great gifts this year and sell them. Because I know that these if these people were paying $45 for baby shoes, you could charge that for these. And then you'll make... $40. I would still charge at least $30 for something very simple. That would take me five minutes. $30 for five minutes is not so bad. Who's size seven? Maybe I can give somebody. Terry Lubin, you've been with me from the heart. I will send those to you because I love you so much. Absolutely. All right, guys. Are there any other questions? Because I have so much more to go over with you guys. And I know that I've spoken like literally the whole day. Oh, I apologize. It's only been two hours. That's not so bad. Normally I'm just going for like 10. Okay. Any other questions, guys? Let me know before I move on to the next topic. Go back to blue and main camera. Okay. Um, if Marcella's on the iPad, I'm not sure if she's checking out my questions, you know. Okay, if anybody has questions, now is the time to ask. I'm gonna quickly run through the specials one more time so that everybody knows what is going on. We have today, for Silly Farm Black Friday, we have, uh, what do you, okay, the, the face fun kits, let me move over. Uh, we have the face fun kits, buy one, get one free. That means that you can buy one, get one free for a friend. If you have two kids, it's two for the price of one, which is a very special deal. And this includes the um, the ones with the rainbow cakes. Normally we don't do that, but I feel so generous and I love Christmas. So those are buy one, get one free. We also have... The rainbow, oh, Artie Cakes, Artie Cakes, buy two, get one free, guys. Uh, buy two, get one free, Artie Cakes. You will be able to, uh, if you love Patty, if you love Susie, if you love Malena, if you love Jillian, if you love me, if you love Flor, they're the, literally the list goes on and on of the amazing, talented people, Cameron, who have created Artie Cakes at Silly Farm. You can get two and then get one free so you can make yourself the most beautiful kit or give them away because you know what? Sharing is caring. Okay. We also have Susie Amaro today. Today she released the Shimmer Collection, the Easy Shimmer Collection, which is her beautiful assortment of cakes that have that gradient, but this time with all shimmer colors. So you're going to be able to get those beautiful shiny colors that I feel look good on every single skin tone okay so they don't just look good on my skin tone they look good on your skin tone and everybody's skin tone so they look great on everybody we also have bling if you like to bring on the bling five packs for five dollars that's a great deal you can do whatever you want you can craft you can create your own she shed is that what it's called you can make everything blingy in your life from your cell phone to your dog whatever you want you can do all of that using the bling packs we also have the clean kit so you can it comes in this beautiful beautiful box and it comes with handy sandy and hand sanitizer and brush bath and a sponge bag so everything comes in this box so that you can just give it to somebody my mom is the biggest germaphobe and my brother-in-law too they literally spray like my mom will spray you down when you come near her okay and she has a mask and a shield and i applaud her because she's been able to keep us all healthy um throughout this whole pandemic but she does that using really good stuff the handy sandy collection i clean my face with brush bath every day so this kit is on sale and it is a fabulous price and a great gift to give to the germaphobe or just anyone in your life i like to be clean okay this sponge bag um, this fabulous sponge bag is on sale for $5 and you get five free sponges inside of it. And if you cut them in half, that means you have 10 free sponges. So that's an even better deal for everybody paying attention and listening. Are all these specials on the Silly Farm website? Yes. Who's asking that? Uh, Sheila. Sheila. Hi, Sheila. Sheila 
Shalita. Shalita. Hi, Shalita. Ooh, okay. Um, everything that I'm talking about, if you go to the front page of Silly Farm, there is a huge banner that says Black Friday Specials. And I put a lot of thought into creating these specials because I want you guys to enjoy them. I want you to use them. Um, I want you to be able to make use of them. So hopefully um, you'll be able to and hopefully you'll enjoy some of them because these are really good deals, right? Okay. Then, ooh la la, let me move over. This palette, let me tell you something, guys. This will not last. I'm probably sure it's already sold out. Uh, we didn't have that many to begin with. This is the Rainbow Prism palette. It is on sale for $99, which means that you're probably saving like $60. Each of those rainbow cakes are probably more. Yeah, maybe you're saving $80. Who doesn't want to put $80 in their pocket? These Rainbow Prism palettes, there's two available, meaning two different styles. You get 10, um, 10 Fab 16 gram colors, four full rainbow cakes inside of a laptop case. This is a great deal. Uh, so go to the front page of Silly Farm and you will see them on there and you can get it right now before they're sold out because it's while supplies last, guys. So, you know, it's, uh, it's really up to you. Okay. Let's see. Oh, okay. So hopefully you're inspired to airbrush. And I don't say this lightly and I don't push airbrushing on everybody. If you are willing to make the commitment to clean your kit, to learn how to use it, to take care of it, airbrushing is going to be a great investment for you. There's a lot of things you can do from murals to shoes, um, to t-shirts, to tanning, to cake decorating, all with your airbrush. So this airbrush system is on sale. You get a free flag and, oh, tell me. Oh, move my bag, got it. Um, you can, you'll get a free flag, 14 foot flag to show off your business when you're ready. It's great if you do festivals and fairs. It's very impressive. It looks good, it uh, looks professional. Um, so you get that stencils, a case, paint, everything. And I'm including an ultrasonic cleaner, guys, so that you can clean your airbrushes at one time. You put them in there and it shakes it clean. You will love me for that. You can also clean your jewelry. Um, but I would say you're going to love having an ultrasonic cleaner. It makes airbrushing 10,000 times easier. So you get all of that. And that is on sale this month as well. Okay. Or this week, this weekend, just this weekend. Sorry. Okay. Also, we, Silly Farm, as you guys know, owns Faba TV. I created it. Uh, so I asked all of my Faba TV teachers, what are your favorite fab colors? Let's put them in a palette. And we have Margie and Desine and Ilse who put together beautiful palettes for you with their favorite combinations. So as you can see uh, right here, Ilse's palette is magnificent, right? Like look at those colors. They're just beautiful fall colors and they're great for outlining so that you don't have to uh, use just black. Like sometimes you want to go a little bit outside of your comfort zone. And this is a beautiful palette for only $15, right? $15 special right now uh, going on on Silly Farm. So go over there and check it out. Okay, do it. did I miss anything else? Oh, and I have Faba TV specials. Okay, so you can have a full year of Faba TV that's going to include access to Canva. So you're going to get all the graphics that I'm making, you guys. You get unlimited classes. There's over 500 classes on balloons, face painting, henna, airbrushing. So if you want to learn more about airbrushing, it's all on Faba TV. And every week, Gabby does a paint along. And I'm wondering if I have Gabby on here now. Give me a second because she was going to join us. Give me one second, guys. Um, give me a second. Give me a second to see if I have her. Because she wanted to tell you guys hi. So there's two specials uh, for Faba TV going on right now. And I encourage you guys. And if you can't afford these, uh, please, please, please don't worry, guys. You can also, um, you, we have a month. And a month is only $24. So I, Gabby is here, so I am going to add Gabby so she can say hi to you guys, okay? Let me, are you ready, Gabby? Yeah, okay, let me add her to the stream, hold on. All right, hi, Gabby, can you hear me? Hi there. Hi. hi. Move over, hey. I know you guys don't see this, right, often. Uh You're on mute. Did I do that? 
Unmute. Unmute me. Did you unmute me? Okay, better? <laughs> okay. So normally you guys don't see me and Gabby at the same time, right? Normally what's happening? What's the matter? Oh, everything okay? Okay. <laughs> um, normally we, oh, it's like Gabby's running the, the paint alongs on Faba TV and she's helping you guys. So first and foremost, I want to say thank you, Gabby, because what you do for me is invaluable. It's priceless. Um, I will tell you guys that I asked Gabby a couple months ago to come on to Faba TV with me to help me because making sure you guys stay motivated and like to paint and are using the classes and recommending classes is not easy. And she, but she has this beautiful, happy energy. And I can't take all the credit. Marcel is the one who said, call her. That girl is sparkly magic. And it's true, right, Marcella? So Marcella said, call Gabby. And I hope that all of you guys are enjoying uh, having Gabby as part of the team. I love to see her paint alongs, but I'm going to let you tell them about your paint alongs and what you want from them in going forward, just so that we can all get on the same page and get happy again together. Woo. Well, thank you for that a beautiful intro. I do appreciate it. Happy holidays. <laughs> hope you had a great Thanksgiving. Happy holidays to everyone. Happy Thanksgiving, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, all, all, all these things. You know what? Happy holidays. This is huge. So Black Friday, right? It's like everyone's favorite time of the year, except waking up at three in the morning. Only downfall. So Heather's got you covered. She's like, you know what? No, we're going to have a live and a decent time where everyone's awake with deals that I that you will not find anywhere else. Like, I love painting supplies, right? Like, if you come to the house, I, everywhere it's like all over the floor on the walls like I paint all it's bad but what, what I'm trying to say is these deals definitely jump on it I don't think we're going to be getting them until maybe next year or if she's feeling extra nice you know <laughs> it's, exactly so if you have any money saved up I definitely recommend doing it now spending it on these things and people that don't have Faba TV do it like get it it even even just for a month okay just to test it and like heather said with the airbrushing classes they're worth doing before you invest in anything even for people that are not big face painters or balloon artists or makeup artists right take the class see if you like it and then go from there to invest in your products because look products are not they're not cheap i wish they were i wish they were like a dollar the dollar store but that's like bad products right they don't they don't work so Heather is the kind of person that truly wants you to be happy and to have things that you like. If you don't like them, she's like, well, I'm not, why am I going to sell it? Like, what's the it's point? True. I don't right? like to. <laughs> and that's amazing because that's not common for building people. They just want your money and then like let you run wild. But she sees you as family. She's like, I want you to have the best without without any stealing right because that's well, bad. thank you don't make me cry <laughs> well more so than anything else part of the best is having someone like you on the team to help the people not just beginners but also just people who need encouragement right because at the end of the day art is just like a language it's just like a skill if you don't use it a little bit of it ends up you lose it, you know, essentially, <laughs> like, it, a lot of us are rusty, I'm not gonna lie to you, like, even I'm just rusty. with my airbrush skill, I was like, <laughs> Oh, how do I do this again? So you know, part of your role at Faba TV is the encouragement role, because I think that that is a gift that you have that a lot of people don't. So, you know, let them know about like your paint alongs and just how they can reach you if they need help and they shouldn't be nervous to ask for help, you know, a recommendation for a class or just like, what do you suggest for something? Because to have that type of person to lean on to me is extremely beneficial. I'm fortunate because I had Marcella and I still do have Marcella to ask her things like test things with her, but not everybody has someone in their close circle who has that. So tell them how to reach you, like what, when, what you know, worksheet Wednesday and your paint alongs are. So uh, on Facebook, you can find me at Gabby at Faba TV. I put the banner right there. Um, uh -huh. um, <laughs> I don't know where it went. Oh, it's on mine now. I don't yeah, know. it's on yours. I don't know how I can move it, but 
that's where you can find me on Facebook. I'm I'm always there. You can always message me having any of your questions that you might have about face painting or balloon twisting, not airbrushing. That would be a Heather question. <laughs> but um, like even about like if, if you have any questions about products or like what you expect out of Fabi TV or Silly Farm, you can always message me. I'm relatively kind of fast responding back um, on my laptop, on the phone. It doesn't really work. It's kind of weird. But also on the official Faba TV group, either uh, two or like three or four times a month, uh, we do paint alongs. So I put a poll up on Facebook like two days before uh, with some ideas and then you get to pick what you want to see painted. So just a few days ago, I had a paint along of um, a Christmas tree, a one stroke Christmas tree. And uh, we really explain the products that we use, um, some cheats that you can also do instead of doing exactly what we're doing and we also share the finished look and of course i ask you like hey you know it's a called a paint along right so we paint along it's not just me making a fool out of myself it's like we do it together right like a, come on guys yeah. <laughs> exactly exactly but that in itself is a gift, guys, because, you know, sometimes it's just like cooking shows. Like, usually I notice when you're at the nail salon, there is a cooking show on TV. I don't know why. Either that or home improvement. And I won't lie to you, the more that I sit there, and I hate cooking. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, I'm awful at it. I made me and my mom peanut butter and jelly like two weeks ago here, and we Dang. both <laughs> threw up. It was so embarrassing. Peanut butter and jelly. Oh, it was awful. I'm still thinking and getting sick. Maybe the peanut butter was old. Regardless, whatever. The point is, the longer I sit at the nail salon and watch, like, what is Barefoot Contessa making something? I'm like, I can do that. I definitely can make that. And then I took her recipe of the lemon chicken. It was, it was gross. Anyway, <laughs> long story short, the more you watch... Can you leave now, Marcella? Marcella had to remind me live that my sister's a very good chef. Both of them are. It skipped over me like it skipped over you. Marcella doesn't have an oven in her house, guys. She doesn't. So, oh no, she doesn't. She doesn't cook. E Anyways, Marcella doesn't cook either. So I guess she is just like my mom. So long story short, the more that you watch something, the more you're engaged in it, the more you participate, the better you become at it, like by default, right? It's kind of like creativity is so contagious and it, you can pass it on, you can use it. And it's very helpful right now in a time where it's easy to get overwhelmed and depressed, right? Like some of us are like home and we can't even help it. We just get sad for no reason. You're like, why am I so sad? I miss painting kids. I miss doing what we love and I miss the money. I miss the excitement and enjoyment of it all. So you being on Faba TV definitely lends itself to um, having that connection to the people. And um, really quickly, Gabby, like tell people about yourself. Like you make videos, you edit, like tell them a little bit for the people who don't know you, which is important. Well, uh, two quick things. Uh, one, Kelly, your comment, hilarious. And I agree, that's painfully, painfully hard to mess up a bee <laughs> as a can of sandwich. And second thing, even if you don't paint or do any of these crafts, right, just watching it is practically like osmosis. I don't know. I think it was Marcella who shared a, a photo on uh, Facebook, and it was this kid having a book and, like, scooping it in his brain. <laughs> it was like this. Well, in, in a way, in a way, it's kind of like that. Just watching them, you might not get it, but then like maybe a week later you might apply and thinking, you know what, that was kind of a good idea. Where did I get that idea from? And you got it from a video or from a photo or from just interacting with somebody. Right. So your brain's amazing. Even though it's like kind of small, it holds so much. And you're just like, where does it go? And then you end up finding it. Yeah. So Absolutely. um, <laughs> um just watch these videos, Paint Alongs, Faba TV, Silly Farm on YouTube, or my YouTube channel called Radiant Art Inspirations. I'll put that right here. Did it work? I think Radiant it's right. Art Inspiration. I love you, Leslie. Leslie's watching. She's recovering. She wasn't Aww. feeling so good. So we love you, Leslie. For those love of you, you, I know Ace will be back next year and will be in Austin, Texas. Um, so I'll tell Leslie that story. But but um, in, in everything Gabby is saying, you know, 
stay motivated. We have a Faba TV forum, guys. If you're not part of it, you do. It's free to join, obviously. It's on Facebook, but it's a closed group. So if you want to participate in Gabby's Paint Along, if you just want to get recommendations about Faba TV classes, if you want to learn more, if you want anything from us, that's our place to help you directly. Because there's a million Facebook groups right now. Um, and that's just the one that's designed specifically for Faba TV people. And it's going to give me a chance to share the graphics with you that I told you guys about. And I'm sorry that it's taken me a little while to roll that out. But I will tell you a funny story before I let you go because I know Gabby has things to do. But I love that red lipstick girl. Look, we're like twins. You're like a Thank younger, you. cuter version of me, okay? <laughs> You're me before all the wrinkles. Okay, so I have been working with Canva. I love Canva. We're going to do a live demo in a few minutes. I love Canva. I finally taught Marcella something. So they have a program called Enterprise, and I was trying to figure out if Enterprise was going to be what we needed to accomplish my goal. So, like, I had to get them on the phone. They're based out of Australia. So I was like, couldn't get anybody on the phone. You have to, like, put in tickets, whatever. Finally, I get a meeting, a Zoom meeting with a representative. And he, I'm explaining to him what I'm doing. And he's looking through my account. He goes, oh, my God, you design a lot. I say, I know I use Canva every single day. I love it so much. And he's, like, scrolling, scrolling. He goes, wow, do you want to interview for a job here? Austin, Texas is where we're located. And it's an amazing place. And they have great barbecue. And you could move here if you want. I can give you a tour of the city. He goes, if you just <laughs> give me two minutes, I can get our HR on the phone. I was like feeling so, aw, so honored that he said that. I was like, sadly, I can't leave Silly Farm. But long story short, it's it was very... I was very flattered that, you know, uh, Canva liked my work. So hopefully we'll turn that into uh, something that's very productive and useful for Faba TV. And lastly, um, for those of you that have video editing questions, if you have YouTube questions, Gabby is a wealth of knowledge. She runs a very successful YouTube channel. Uh, so she understands the back end as well as the front end in terms of tags and what to put up and what uh, video footers to put up. So if you want to know more, please feel free to reach out to her. Again, you can reach her um, on our Faba TV forum. You can reach her uh, on Facebook and just make sure you're utilizing her because she is a great, great tool. She's like a personal trainer for face painters okay except we can eat and paint at the same time <laughs> i ate so much yesterday i'm wearing my fat bands i can't even tell you oh my gosh um, <laughs> there's no more room so bad um when it comes to video editing um it, it's definitely another very creative outlet because just like with face painting, you already have it imagined right before you put it on paper or whatever your canvas is. The same with video editing. You kind of have like a mental idea of what you want, where you want those cuts or those like transitions to be. And when you put it on there, like, wow, this was, this was so easy. Like, why don't I do this 10 years ago? Right. So um, for people that even want to make YouTube channels with face painting, um, please use my platform or um, Heather's platform as an idea of how to make one, like the setup and how to do it, the intros, all that kind of fun stuff. Um, because we want to help you. We, we want you to push your creativity as far and as wide as you can. So my Instagram is, no, my YouTube is Radiant Art Inspirations, or you can find a bunch of really cool videos of um, on the job designs. They're not like the really intricate, scary ones because I don't have that kind of patience. Um, so these these are all like ones that you can do at an event. And um, I really hope that they can help you, even like just inspire you to like paint at home or to paint on your on your little your little monsters or like your neighbor's monsters, you know, monster. or on yourself. <laughs> Exactly. No, this, this is all really important um, information that Gabby's sharing with you. Again, we encourage you to join the Faba TV family. For me, it is uh, a joy, an honor, a pleasure to edit all of these teachers' classes every week. As many of you know, this year has been very difficult. I lost John in the sense of being here with me every day filming. I don't have Vanessa. So like now I went back to square one and now I'm editing everything. And it did 
two things. At first, I was like stressed out, right? But now I get to watch everybody's class. And it makes me fall in love every single week with new art. From this week on Monday, we had Jillian and we had um, Ilse, two new lessons on Fava TV. And the week before that, we had new lessons. Every Monday, there's new lessons. And you did a paint along on Wednesday. And all of those things help me to stay motivated, enthusiastic, seek, seek out new teachers for everyone. So we encourage everybody. There are two specials going on. It's 125 that gives you a gift card to Silly Farm. And you can use it to Fabaic too to start your savings. Um, or 250 and that's for the year. And that's going to give you access to all of the new graphics coming up, which what that's what we're going to go into next, actually. We are going to do a live demo on how to create some marketing material so that you guys can decide if you want to download my files and rework them or if you want to start from scratch. Either one is going to be up to you. So, Gabby, I hope you have a great weekend. Don't work too hard, okay? Um, if anyone has questions, reach out to Gabby. Find her on our Facebook page. She's incredible. We love, love, love her. And thank you, Gabby. Have a great weekend. Happy holidays. Thank you. Oh, wait, well, right before I go, last yes, thing. Yes. Um, for people that haven't signed up for Fava TV, um, th like this weekend's so big because you're, look, Heather's giving you free money practically. Like you can get a 25 or a $50 gift card at Silly Farm. I mean, like free who's gonna, who else is going to offer money. you that? Like, like free faith. Free so money, if, free money. If you haven't, do it now because you won't regret it. Okay? That That's it. That makes me so happy. That, that makes me so happy. And you know what? Thank you. We appreciate you. Uh, you're the bomb.com. You're the bomb. And I will see you next week. Okay. All Sounds right. Good. I'll see you next week. Bye. Bye. Bye, Gabby. Okay. All right, guys. We are moving right along. Um, okay. Let me make sure that I figure this out. Sorry, guys. Okay. I think that this is right, right? I think so. Yes. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we are, we're moving right along. What I'm thinking is happening with the audio on the classes is that it's, it's not running through this program. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the demonstration of the marketing right now. And then I'm going to restart this stream to show you two classes, Marcella Bustamante and uh, Susie, Susie Amaro. So you're going to have two classes after this one. For anyone who wants to stick around, paint along, uh, I love Marcella Bustamante. She is incredible. We have her whole line of brushes here at Silly Farm, the Blazing Bl Brush Collection, which are beyond beautiful. And of course, I have to say that I love my brushes the most because I made them, but I really love her brushes too. That script liner, honey, changed my whole life. So um, you'll see after we do this, then I have Marcella Bustamante and Susie Amaro. We just have to restart the stream. So I apologize about that. But for anybody who wants to hang out and and be able to paint along with us, I encourage you to do it. And maybe by that time, I'll figure out if I can. So if you go to the that one but then i need to be in the corner the, the third camera the second line yep there okay am i still in okay all right guys for those of you still with me i hope that you like this uh kind of tutorial that i'm gonna do for you this is canva okay canva is an online program to help you design so Basically, when you log in, what you're going to see is you're going to see uh, the options of all the different templates. OK, so you'll see pre-sized templates, uh, pre-designed templates or just blank canvases. And that is something that is a beauty and a gift. So there's three versions. There is free. There is a pro, which is $12 a month, or there is uh, the enterprise. You don't need that. I already did the, the lesson for you. OK, so. As you can see, if you pick a template, what you're going to do is you can start creating anything you want with it. You can change things. You can um, work the colors. You can rearrange the sizes. You can move the font around. The beautiful part about um, Canva is that there's so many different ideas already preset for you. And that's what you're also going to get with Faba TV. It's just going to be me designing things that match our industry. So let's go through a little tutorial. Basically, I pick this template with the computer. And when you see the sky scene in the background, that means that that is a picture place holder. So first thing I'm going to do is just create this content to match 
something that, like a party idea, right? Because now we're going to market the idea of uh, selling a pre-paint kit. So what do you need to have on your graphics and your marketing? You need to tell a story with the least amount of words. And how do you do that? You do that with pictures, colors, and mostly pictures. So in this particular design, what I'm teaching you guys is how to create marketing material for um, to sell like paint services, virtual paint services. So I'm going to just search their feature in the elements feature called rainbow so that, you know, I have um, a rainbow background and using the pivot tool, I'm just going to kind of rotate it because I want it more as kind of like from the bottom coming up versus in the middle. And you just kind of hold it steady and find that little spinner. And that's going to be a background. So now it's like a colorful background. And because I like to balance things, um, I'll probably put one at the top. So I dragged in this picture of, I believe this is Ksenia's daughter. Ah, whose daughter is this? So beautiful. And then we need to work on the lettering. So the cool thing is Canva has all these presets of different letterings. I like the glow feature. So I just change out the font. And obviously you want to change that glow feature because that's way too strong. And then so I just changed the intensity of it. And then you can just change colors to match and to uh, make things bigger and position them where you want. So if you click on the color selector, it will give you all the presets of all the colors already inside of your design, which is great. You don't have to find them. So I changed it to the same purple that's like at the end of the smoke cloud. And now I'm going to just kind of play with the rest of it. So I duplicate this um, pattern, which is that kind of watercolorish rainbow. And you want to flip it. And if you ever mess something up, the way you get back is you just press Command Z. Command Z undoes your last thing if you're working on a, a Mac. And then what I did is I just flipped it. I flipped it so that it, it kind of mirrors um, the design. So I undid it and I'm going to add some layers, as you can see, and just move it down and shrink it so that I'm going to be able to bring in that same pattern. So now, as you can see, it's kind of matches top and bottom. So it brings your eyes kind of balanced, um, which is to me an important part of design. So now I'm going to copy the same font so I don't have to redo everything. And I'm just going to shrink down the word fun and move it to the top because what am I trying to capture here? I'm trying to sell the idea of fun party ideas. And a graphic like this, you can use on Pinterest. You can use on uh, Facebook to advertise your services. Um, so again, the goal is to tell a story with as little words as possible. Because what happens is the more font that you put on a small graphic that is meant for Instagram or meant for Facebook, they can't read it, especially because they're scrolling from their phone. OK, so please keep that in mind when you're scrolling from your phone, your your viewing panel is very tiny. So if you fill it up with a thousand words, they can't read it. A picture can say a lot of words for you. That's why that saying a picture is worth a thousand words is true. So I'm going to expand and make my logo larger because the logo is how they reach me. And I'm going to just take one another quick look at it and say, did it accomplish everything I wanted it to? Which is, is my phone number there? Check. Is the call to action there? Meaning, what is it that I want to happen from this ad? Do I want them to call me? Do I want them to text me? Do I want them to book me? So right now I'm going to put call, text, or email um, us today so that, you know, they can do those things, right? That's your call to action. Let your customers know what you want them to do. Don't leave it off. This is marketing material. This is not your personal, you know, show off how cool I am. These are marketing materials, which means you need to tell your customers what you want. So uh, call, text, email us today, planning your next special event, an awesome event.
Now saving it, you have several ways to save your uh, designs as a PNG, as a JPEG, whatever you want, um, whatever your desired format. All right, let's go through another one. Uh, as you can see, Canva has a zillion, billion, gazillion different already pre-designed layouts. Now, if you're creative, use them, redesign them, add your own flair. If you don't have time for that, that is what's going to happen for you on Faba TV now. I am going to give you six graphics a month geared towards you. They will have placeholders. Um, they will be just so that you can add your own information and not have to think about it. Change the colors, add your information, and done. Post it. Do whatever you want. Okay, so now let's go through one using or selling the shoes. So this is another pair of shoes that I did. So I brought in the picture, and it was on its side. So I need to adjust the picture first to fit back in that frame and expand it and then shrink it so that our crop it is the word so that it fits back in that frame. And I love this template because it has already moving graphics in it. You see those stars that are kind of like bursting. You see what they do and um, and they kind of make it pop. And you would save that feature as a um, as a MPEG or MP4, which we'll go over in a minute. So now I'm going to just add the correct text because this isn't a holiday party. This is made with love gift ideas, right? So that people know these are handmade. This is you making them. People love handmade stuff. And then I'm going to add what else I want, you know, uh, personalized gifts from the heart. And then as you could tell, it does not fit in that size. So you're going to adjust the font and and then make maybe make it a little bit easier to read font because certain fonts are not easy to read when the letters are so close to one another so then just make it big enough to read because remember they are going to be reading from their cell phone so that green is a little bit dark for me so i'm going to try to brighten it up because i like everything bright and so I'm just going to go in and select the things that are green and make them brighter. Because for me, like I said, I like it to be nice, bright, and eye-catching. And you'll be able to do that with color. And the way that you do that with color is because you are artists. So you know what colors look good next to each other. You know that you wouldn't look at a, take a second look at a picture if it wasn't screaming your name, if it wasn't you know, pretty to look at. So just keep that in mind, guys. So, okay, we're going to add our little fab events at the bottom so they know where to reach me and make it big enough so that they can see it. And I'll center the uh, text because for me that's important. And I'm going to add a second little bit of text uh, to let them know it's not just shoes, right? You can do shoes, shirts, bags. One thing you want to do is make sure you spell things correctly. I've spelled things wrong, so... Doesn't, doesn't look good for you and your business if you spell things wrong. Uh, so just pay attention to the spelling. And again, I'm going to just match up the fonts. This font That font matches the font that's in the top right-hand corner so that it all flows together nicely. And then since there's really no black in this design, I'm going to just add, uh, change it over to a red to match and make everything kind of flow in unison. OK, and then you have two ways to save this design. You can save it with those moving graphics, which is an MP4, or you can save it as a flat image where it would just be a JPEG. And it's up to you. Um, Instagram lets you use these moving graphics. And uh, now a lot of the platforms do that they didn't in the past. So it's up to you guys to decide if you want to do that and uh, and see if that works for you, if you like adding these little graphics that move. So let's just make sure that my call to action is there. Call or email today. I am a person who likes people to call because I believe that if I talk to the customer, I can sell them and close the deal. I think sometimes on email and text, if they don't like the pricing, it, they're very easy to just ghost you. Where on if you're talking to them, they're not as easy to just hang up on you if you don't like their price. And your voice can sell it, 
right? Your voice can be like, I love doing shoes. They're the best gift in the whole world. When my kids open up their shoes, they die. They were so excited. My kids love Sonic. You can sell them if you talk to them. So personally, I like to uh, talk to people, but it's up to you. So um, again, you can save it in different formats. And just like that, I showed you guys two different ways to create graphics, okay? So I know that this was like a little bit uh, sped through, but more so than anything else, I wanted you guys to move me back to the blue in the main camera because I think that video, you got to clear everything though. I think every, I think that one was done. <laughs> okay, perfect. Okay. Everybody give Lisa a round of applause. She is running the show. And let me tell you something. The program that I use to do this is not easy. It, it's not that it's hard. It's just a lot. Like think about um, like in Mario when we used to play as kids and it had and you had to jump on all those different like bridges and they're always moving like this. That's what that program is. You got to like clear one screen, remove this screen. It's a lot of work. It's like a lot of work. So I definitely applaud Lisa for that. So I know that that was kind of like a sped through version of what the marketing materials looks like, but I wanted you guys to see what a design process looks like. And then you can decide if that is for you or you want to take advantage of being part of the Faba TV special where you will receive six graphics a month that you can do whatever you want with. You're going to be able to customize them. You're going to be able to add your logo. You're going to be able to turn them into whatever you want. And I will tell you, it's very helpful to have kind of like a recipe already there for you. And then you take it and run with it as opposed to a complete blank slate. Like if you gave me a box of or a, a pound of sugar and a pound of flour and a pound of milk or a liter of milk, I don't even know. I don't cook, clearly. Um, I wouldn't know what to do with it. But if you gave me the Duncan Hines box that says put three eggs and a quarter cup of oil, I can figure it out. And the same thing for you guys. I have confidence that you can get to be great designers and make amazing marketing material. I just think sometimes we need a little bit of help to do that. So that's what my Canva uh, program is going to be. You're going to be able to download six different graphics a month on Faba TV. And I think that that's a very useful tool. In addition to if you need personalized help with your graphics, Gabby and I are here to help you. Uh, we can't personally design every single graphic that you're ever going to need. But if you have questions like about your logo being transparent or if you just want some feedback, that's what we're here for. So I encourage you guys to use um, all of that information. All right. Whew. What a day, what a day. Is there any questions before we let everybody practice and learn some more? Anything else? Because I can't see them on mine anymore. Yes, I know. I have like a whole clock right here. Marcella wants to go home. Oh, I appreciate you. Okay, I've been speaking for three hours so far, guys. I hope that you've been able to take something from um, our broadcast today. I hope that you've been able to uh, enjoy it, that you got something out of it. Please do not forget about the amazing specials going on this weekend at Silly Farm. We have uh, sales on brushes, on brush bath, on our clean kits. We have beautiful palettes. We have airbrush systems that are the best deal you are going to get in terms of a really great system. So you're going to get all of your airbrush guns. You're going to get um, uh, a case and paint and a free flag and a free ultrasonic cleaner. Susie Amaro is going to be coming up in a few minutes um, and she's going to show you guys how magnificent the um, the new easy strokes are. You can show all of those. You can go through, just keep putting them up. I don't mind. Uh, Lisa is killing it. You want to take over for me at church? <laughs> I use this program to produce church every Thursday and Sunday. And if you work with your spouse, you know how stressful that is. And like one day I released the doves too fast. I thought he was going to beat me up. <laughs> he was like, you let the doves go. Long story short. Anyways, um, so 
we have so many amazing specials going on this weekend. Remember when you shop at Silly Farm, you support small business. We make all of these arty cakes and rainbow cakes by hand. Uh, we package the glitter. We make the handy sandy. We worked hard, a team of women. We worked together. We made the handy sandy formula. We're so proud of it. Um, and that's an accomplishment. You know, so every time you guys make something, I'm so proud of you. I try to share as much as I can from you guys. So by all means, you know, if you have something for me to share, please let me know as well. Okay, so before I go, please let, because like I said, I'm sorry, guys. I know many of you are, have been on this stream for three hours. Hi, Jackie. Hi, Michelle. Hi, everybody. Uh, let me say hi to everybody who I can see. Leslie, I'm glad you're feeling better. Um, don't forget the Ilsi palette. Face fun kits are buy one, get one free. There's so much. So this is what I'm going to do because I don't think, try to load up Marcella's for me. Um, to see if that one will, if the audio will work. If not, I'm restarting the screen. So you're gonna be able to enjoy two classes, one from Marcella Bustamante and one from Susie Amaro. And both of them are amazing. They're great teachers. Make sure to check them out on fabatv.com uh, and learn from them. And then of course, stay connected with us. Uh, I love you, Kelly. Thank you for, for joining us today. Thank you, everybody. Let's see if this works. If not, I'm just going to restart the stream. Sorry, guys. I can hear it there, but I don't think I could hear it here. Hold on, because... Oh, they can still hear me. Okay, let me stop this stream. You want to go back and announce it? Okay. And we Okay, guys, so I did figure out what the problem is. Okay, so right now I'm using, turn that down just a little bit. Um, I'm using two different programs to run this. And I think when you import external um, video, that that's what's happening. So, oh, I think I figured it out. Just give me one second, Marcella, come and talk to them for a minute while I figure it out. Sorry, guys, I'm going to figure this one out. Okay, I don't know what she wants me to talk about. <laughs> I mean, oh, come on, I can't tell them a real dirty joke in here because there might be children watching and mine are really dirty. <laughs> uh, I told her I wanted to be one of those uh, sex therapies, older women that go into the talk shows. <laughs> That's the best thing about getting older, you know, is you get your gray hair and then you lose all your, uh, yeah, all your filters and you can say whatever. And then if they say something, you say, well, I'm old, <laughs> you know, so, so it's good. But anyway, she's figuring out what to do. And, <clears throat> you know, Heather tapes all my classes for the libraries. And let me tell you, I could not do it without her. I am just so lucky that she's here, that she can help me along, that she knows all this computer stuff because I'm not very computer illiterate, but I did learn how to do Canva. Well, I'm not really good at it yet, but from the beginning when I started, I'm really good. So now I'm, I'm just going to keep going. And as you can see, some of the little, I, the reason why I changed the banner on the Everything Face and Body Art Forum almost every day is because I'm practicing my Canva. <laughs> so I hope you like, I hope you like my banners that I make for you. And um, also, you know, well, if you're not a, a member of the Face and Body Art Forum, please come over and join us because another thing that Heather does is that she gives me a lot of prizes to give away because she knows there's nothing I like better than to giving things away. That's why I'm so bad at marketing. I don't want to sell them, I want to give them to you. But okay, yeah. tell them that I'm gonna restart this. okay, so listen, 
that means that they, it's going to go away and then it's going to come back okay she says that um she's going to restart this so don't go away just this is going to go away you stay right there and as soon as it pops again you come back and meet us again okay promise me all right see you in a few